Hello, welcome to the Carlton Blue YouTube channel and our Football Manager 2022 stream. My name is Dan Ronson and I'm joined this evening by another coaching staff rotation, Dan Bardell. Welcome back. You right, mate? Yep, still mightily offended by being dropped for a week. We've already talked about it. It's a rotation. Nothing special happened whilst I was away, though. Those bad transfer decisions have been made, <laughs> which I'm not happy with at all. Well, we'll get to that later. Um, yeah. A couple of people commented already. Jack Burnett says first one live for me. Jack French also the first one he's managed to catch live, so that's that's good. Thanks for joining us. Um, we're going to jump straight into the game screen because absolutely why not? I should as well. I don't, you know, like on a eight out of ten cats does countdown. Mm -hmm. I bought a mascot. Really? Okay, tell me about uh, it. The Ian Tyler figure. To, to watch over us whilst we can you say that because I can't well, actually see myself on the screen. I can't see it at the moment, so I'll have to watch it on the YouTube uh, version. Oh, there's, right there's an Ian Tyler figure there just to just to watch over us and guide us on this journey. Okay. Is there is there a Gareth Southgate behind you as well or something? Yeah, big Gareth Southgate behind. It doesn't really look like him, to yeah. be honest. But I found a box of things at my mum and dad's, a box of football men, and that big Gareth Southgate was in there, so I bought it back home in there. I've like, <laughs> just seen the Ian Tyler. <laughs> Oh, that's good. Yeah, thanks for bringing that. Oh, I've got a current blue mug and literally nothing else here that's a, a worth showing, so I'm just going to move on. Okay. Um, the last stream that we did was me, James and Pat, I think, the original trio, um, kind of carried on to some degree of what we set up in the previous one. Uh, we were, we're now five unbeaten, beat Wolves, Brighton. We started off the last episode by hammering Norwich, 3-1 uh, up before they got us sending off and then saw that Cameron Archer scored, by the way, off the bench, which, oh, yeah, was, nice. which was nice. Uh, Drew with Newcastle, we were lo losing. Leon Bailey scored a volley on the 83rd minute, which is a... That's not a bad result, one one away. It's all right, but they are 17th, I think. Yeah, 17th. Still, it's okay. Uh, Any it's point right. away from home is decent. They've got Hansi Flick as right. the manager, I've just said. Yeah, and then Brentford in the FA Cup, which we are miles off the top six, so we probably are going to have to try and win the FA Cup to uh, get into Europe. And we drew with Brentford, and we got it on extended highlights, and we saw about two things all game. So that was just a game that you write off and say, Nothing we could really do, to be honest. It just kind of flew by. Um, so we've got Tottenham today, and then Leicester. They're ninth and sixth, and then Brentford in that third round replay, which is pretty crucial. Uh, we started a little bit earlier, so we'll probably be here for the next hour and a half, maybe two hours, depending on how things go. We might squeeze in that Everton game again, depending on how things go and how, how what mood we're in, in in an hour's time. We've got problems with players on international <clears throat> duty. Yeah, is that African Cup of Nations? Yeah, so Camber's gone, Bailey's gone. Um, Traore has gone. I mean, literally, we can only field eight subs because all of these are injured or out on loan. Well, or let's go and get someone from the youth. Well, we'll come to that in a second. Okay. Um, Ozzy Alexander says, evening, Dan and Dan. Tom Cowley, uh, welcome, Tom. He says, finally managed to catch this one, even all. Bardell, masterclass incoming, question mark. What do you Tom think? knows. Tom knows. <laughs> Ralph Fortin also says, Bardell is back. Welcome, three points. I mean, big boots to fill. Um, the people know. We were just talking off air that you've recently played Tottenham in your own save and beat them. So I'm, I'm looking forward to how you beat them and implementing that here, basically. <laughs> I've beat them twice. I won from a goal from a set piece and on penalties in the second game in the League Cup. So I'm no expert, but I get two clean sheets. My, my teams are built on clean sheets. That's what I do. <laughs> but I'm Leicester at the moment and I've scored nine goals in eight games, but I've only conceded four. Okay. So yes, I'm struggling in front of goal. Well... We were messing around with the skin on the last episode and I said I'd, I'd tweak it between this and I've gone back to the default setting anyway because I couldn't get it to work. But I had to continue into the Tottenham game and then I just quit out. I played uh, about two minutes that game and Ollie Watkins scored in the first two minutes. So I'm hopeful of just like just not touching anything, <laughs> but as can continue and the same kind of thing will happen again. We're by Nicker. Well, we're after him. We've we've inquired we've about him. We've got no him. money. Uh, well, we've put... Eight million down for Todd Cantwell, who has accepted a contract but hasn't actually decided if he wants to come yet. Oh, I want to pull that. There's a big debate out of that, and we will get to that when it comes. And I think our remaining budget is six million, is what we've got left at the moment. Is so that after Cantwell? That's after Cantwell, yeah. I think we pull the Cantwell off, honestly. Yeah, we'll, we'll come to that. He might, he might not want to come anyway. Uh, I've, I've gone back to him and said, look, do you want to sign that contract or not? And he said, it's a big decision. I don't want to rush it. Um, and yeah, he will sign it. He'll it's he's got an offer from Burnley statement. as well, so... He's not going to go to Burnley. We'll see what happens, but we'll come to that later on. Um, oh. Holly Jane says, this is a very awkward time. It, yeah, it's slightly earlier. Half five is, is a weird time, but you know, there's still a few people here, so we'll, 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 we'll go straight into it. Um, oh. We'll have a look at the team in a second. This is how we were set up from the last game. Um, I assume you're going to have some kind of concern, so hit me. 
I'm not sure about Luiz as a ball winning midfielder support for a star. No, I think that's such no. I'd put him as a defensive midfielder, defend for this game. I think that's what he was on before, anyway. Okay. This new guy is not Flo Mobber at all. You're spending an extortionate amount on him as well. Yeah, but it's only a low enough. He's got good stats. First touch, 17. Dribbling, 17. Passing, 17. Technique, 16. After Workout that, it's not 12, brilliant. But... Teamwork, 12. No. Yeah, but as part of a three. Not for three. Me. If he was a number 10, maybe. Can you play number Never 10? a DM. Not Never really. a DM ever yeah. in a million years. Yeah, DM strange with 11 tackling, but his favourite position is a deep line playmaker, defend. It's a good so... passing, but we're not a passing team. We're a fluid counter attack team, aren't we? Is the yeah, way we can change it. that. We can change that. We've got direct passing, giving the ball and boot it up the wings. That's the, that's the thing. You don't want to put everyone on direct passing. You just want to put him on direct passing then. All right, well, let's do that then. But you don't want like McGinn on direct passing or. Standard or short? Because he's he's a date line playmaker, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Don't you? Also, you wouldn't have him as a date line playmaker in that position. But this is just what if I walked back into her? What we put him as advanced playmaker? I mean, that is technically his favourite. He's like you just said. He's more of a number ten than a DM. We've tried. He's basically the Morgan Sanson replacement. And you're saying he's not a great signing because we just compare him with Sanson very quickly. Because he's injured for nine. Santos barely ever played when I've been there. We've always played Nakamba. Mm, technically better than, than Sanson, but after that, not really much in it between them. I um, still think there's... I mean, we're playing Morgan Sanson 60k a week. That's ridiculous. At least he's your own player, though. Mm, I just liked his name. He's got villain. Uh, we'll do transfers afterwards, because I've come with a, a couple of suggestions. Okay, come on then. But we need to get someone off the broth that out of the youth team onto the bench. Uh, yeah, might as well blood someone if you've got nine subs. Yeah, fair enough. Um, what, what position do we need filling? Mid central midfield, I'm presuming. We've got Ramsey, Chuckle Maker, Ings, and Archer, uh, Young, Twans, Abbey, and Hawes as the defender, so yeah, a winger, maybe. A wing, so winger, yeah. Who have we got? I'd say Aaron Ramsey's going to end up being the best one, but he's not a winger. Yeah. Where are we? Man, this list is. What's Chapoke saying? It's random whether they, they turn to be good or not, these players. Finishing four, it's not good. Off the ball four, there's all kinds of problems there. With Where that. is Aaron Ramsey, by the way? Or did I, just I did say go I did say Oh, yeah. Oh, what about this Timothy there. Ingram, but I can't say his name. He's, he's going to be good in real life. I think he's going to be near the first term soon. I think Gerard really? quite likes him by the sounds of things. Yeah, I think he's going to be one that gets near the first term soon. Go on, then. Let's just put him in there for the sake of it. We'll put Aaron Ramsey because he's better. Oh, I'm already on the process. I mean, he's not going to come on anyway, so it doesn't matter. Just let's, just, the experience. let's just get on with it. Uh, anything else you want to change here? A couple of comments. I mean, um, tons of stuff I'd change, but, you know, we haven't got time. <laughs> Martinez comments. is injured. Sorry, we've had two comments from Dal and Jack who both say along the same long, say things along the same lines. Everyone have a shot every time that Bardell mentions his own save or slags off James and Pat. <laughs> I haven't said anything about James and Pat. <laughs> I'm sure they're I'm sure they're very nice guys, but they're just not football managers. Um and Holly also says no swearing, please. So yeah, Okay, that means a that means a kid's watching. That's fair, yeah. yeah. Can, you, can you put Valar as not a dead line player maker? I thought we'd already gone through this. Yeah, let's put him advanced player maker. I think that's now can we click on him and have a look at the stuff? That intrigues me. Not that. What? Match in, his match instructions. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Okay. Uh yes, how do I do that? What foot is he, by the way? Oh dear, mate. Oh, I don't know how to get. <laughs> I don't know how to get up. What I'm looking for. <laughs> What's he click, not on doing? His, click on his shirt number. I am clicking on his shirt number. He's 14, by the way. Connor Haran's number. I know we have discussed um, this. I wasn't happy. I'd, you'd be better off just recording Connor. No, it's not good enough. Yes. I can't do what you're asking me to do here. It doesn't want to do it. You there? This. Are we on this just? Oh, okay. Instructions. There we go. This is what we're yes, looking for. This is right. Yes, here we go. <laughs> Now we can change his passing to Dorit. You've yeah, got okay. good dribbling as well, so get him to dribble more. Okay. That's it. That's, That's fine. Yeah. Okay, right, we've got to the end. Uh, any Shall of these instructions you want to deal with? I put low crosses on, by the way, because Tottenham's defence is very tall, was my thinking. I just find, I've, I've noticed, you're better off just doing mixed. Okay. Because then I'll just do whatever they think is... I don't know, against Spurs, whether we want to be a bit more disciplined and a bit less wide. You know, I'm always defence first. Yeah, I can do that. No, I think that's fine. Anything else you want to look at? 
No, I wouldn't have it. El Ghazi's an inside forward either, but I've moved the inverted winger attack. Okay. El Ghazi did well last time he played football under me. Did he? In this year, remember. he, he can remember he got he was him and Troy all right coming in the back. Yeah, yeah. Some, some decent wins. He's actually got a goal and two assists in his last five games. I tell you what, I'm not looking forward to real life in Afghan when oh, yeah. the team goes missing. No, I know. Yeah, it's not great, is it? All those out. Nakamba, uh, Trezeguet, who's still injured, but he's. I'm not saying. I'm not, I'm not saying do it. Could you recall Connor if you wanted to? Um, Especially during this crisis point with no players available, and then we could lo- we could loan him again. No, he's, no we he's can't. Good. It's just he's not as good as look at this two two stars compared to. I just ignore that. You don't look four at star that. Villar. Look at this. Way better. He's, um, gonna, he's not. He's not combative enough for the middle of the park, Villar. It's just not. Carry on, uh, you've done it now. I can't. I can't change it. I, I was the wrong way for me not to be here. Yeah, well, this is what's going to happen, isn't it? There's too many, too many cooks. Uh, Dow says I'm into my second season of Villa, and I've just signed Alan from Everton for fifty million. Do you think I've been done over? Yes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, low crosses are so overpowered. Keepers are so slow reacting to low crosses when you have a man attacking the back post. Okay. Want to to think about? Um, Very are, are we happy to to move on here? Yeah, plan. Start. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we'll go for it. I'm a bit worried um, about Martin has been injured in goal. Oh, so you've bought players not fit. Yeah. Paul Groin wants two days. He'll be fine. Just let someone else have the goal kickers. <laughs> that's what they're doing in real life. <laughs> it's just because he's new to the team. He's not fully fit at all. He's not up to, to spec. I think, I think, I might be wrong, but I'm sure he got an assist in the last game on his debut. Okay. But I could have fully really, made that up. I want to know what footy was. That was what I wanted to know. I didn't really... Well, next time I can check, I oh, will find yeah, that out. I'm not going to go through the rigmarole again. You need to click on things again. Um, I don't know where anything is. That's the problem. Um, anything? I mean, this team talks are pretty rubbish, aren't they? Are we at home? Yeah. We're at home, yeah. Just go out there and enjoy yourselves. We've got players missing. Yeah. I, mean, I don't I don't expect a fat lot here, to be honest. I mean, Harry Kane's not playing, so that's a good start. Yeah, Dali Ali's playing up front for some reason. Dali um, Ali's too good in this. He's, he's rubbish in real life. Doesn't seem to want to be a footballer anymore. Oh, I can't even find it there. Which one do it? I don't, I don't want to find this out for you because I know that you, okay. you'll be precious about it. I'm interested. I won't there. I've got to Google it, I suppose. Right foot. Okay, fine. Okay. Uh, fluid counter attack, but in transition, counter is not ticked. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> don't know what mm-hmm. that is. It's fine. Uh, At least Bings isn't yeah. top goal scorer anymore. That's progress. Yeah, Watkins got that hat trick, which has boosted him up. Uh, oh, Danny yeah. Ings has still only got one goal in eighteen games or eighteen appearances, which is ridiculous. Um, but yeah, come on, then let's kick off. I've uh, just notched up the match speed, by the way, because a couple of what? people complained about it, saying it was too slow in the last few streams, watching the centre backs pass it to each other. But I feel like this is like that one was probably too slow, and this one's probably too quick. But I don't know like this. We can uh, we can always vary it. Away. Can we put vary it up? Sorry. Can we slow it down? I don't know what's going on. Already he wants it slowed down. I think this one is too slow, though. I think they're right. Well, this is a bit quicker than natural proper speed, so this is the, the middle yeah, ground. This is the one got. we had it on last time. <laughs> yeah, this is fun. It's not about the audience. It's about what I enjoy. <laughs> I mean, it is about the audience when there's people watching. This is all right, though. It's a good start. You, you get excited whenever we come forward, even if we're oh, not yeah, doing anything. That's yeah. You got to take the little wins, haven't you? Here we go, Ollie. Oh, oh. oh, that's a good save. Um, why do I have the board try and block every player I want to sign? Is that normal? Depends who you is with. It villa, is it the Villa board? Yeah, it might be obvious that you don't have enough money to make the deal actually work. What's going on here? Let's go. Ings has got 12 success. goals for me. That's my only success. I don't know how anyone's got Danny Ings scoring any goals. So again, some of the tweets we've had of him scoring 25 Ooh. goals in the first season. I, just, I don't know how, how they've done that. Have you seen the player that you've got on fitness, mate? We don't have anybody else. Literally, there's no one Jack else playing Abraham's, the field. Well, we're going to have to get someone on for him. Yeah, but he doesn't go half time. A half time, but he's been booked. <laughs> so is <Luis. laughs> Oh, God. We need to mingle goal from a court. Look at the state of it. We're 23 minutes in. <laughs> yeah, and McGinn's dead. Yeah, too fair. This is the. I mean, it's a busy period, isn't it? He he's given everything. Out, he's he's given on, everything man. after 23 minutes. <laughs> they can't take him off now. It's embarrassing. 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Surely we have to get rid of him if he's not fit. What's, what's Chubby Mendes scores like? Oh, let's just get into half time. Yeah, 
he's got he's got the energy to get hard. Maybe we'll have a set of re- we'll give him a look as I had half time. He might have a, <laughs> might have a rebirth. I'm encouraged by what I'm seeing so far. Watkins still on goal. Next we're in. Oh, he's chipped the keeper. Oh, yes. oh, he has. Yes. Tara Mings assist as well. <laughs> Mings is just doing everything for what, us. What a creative player Tara Mings is. The counter attack so, was executed with almost surgical precision. The commentator. I thought that. I thought that. Here's Mings, long ball up, Watkins off the shoulder. A little Someone was keeping him on side, the far oh. centre back. Oh, it was a lovely finish. Love that. Love that. What a start to the stream. I know 30 minutes. <laughs> I was having 30 minutes in the game. One of our players is virtually dead. <laughs> yeah, but we're winning and that's all that counts. And we're winning. Tottenham are good. No, no. It's a, this could be my third win against Tottenham in the space of half, half an hour. <laughs> I mean, we are going to have to get Villar off at half time, especially on a yellow card. We need, we need legs in that midfield against Tottenham. Um, I'd like to look at what Mecca scores, if that would be possible. Uh, yeah, we can do that. We could get Ashley Young into central midfield a lot of it in real life. <laughs> uh, this is Carney's stats. Uh, they're no. pretty, pretty good for an 18 year old. Yeah, but it's not for this game. I don't think that we're better with Ramza. So we just have a quick look at Ramsey's as well? Yeah, we should. Yeah. Tackling nine. I don't think so, football manager. What's that work, right? 13. Yeah. Would... He's good. We have to put him on. Yeah, I agree. Uh, Rod says, I'll just defer all transfer business to Lange. Is it Lange? We had this last time, was it Lange? Langer? Uh, Langer. I think Langer. in the end. I get confused um, with, the, with the Wolves manager. Yeah, saves a bunch of clicks and busy work. Um, yeah, you, right. that's part of the, one of the funniest things of playing football manager is buying people. What do we want for Jack Ramsey? Should we just go central? Yeah, just central midfielder support. Let's not overcomplicate it for him. Yeah. Those instructions we apply to Villar are to him, aren't they? It's not to the position. I don't know. Yeah, no instructions. Possibly. Um, are we, should we be hitting thingy here? Counter? Counter press. Uh, or maybe we'll counter when possession has been won because they're going to push up a little bit. Yeah. Being behind. When there's waste on the wing. Yeah. We, I mean, we had success with the 4 2 3 1 in the last couple. So, but it's, it's Tottenham. We've gone with the extra midfielder. I'll be tempted to, if this is more attacking, my, get rid of Louise yeah. and put Wendy in the 10 and try around the right. But all our wingers are off playing in the, in the AFCON. Um, I think. You wanted a left back, didn't you? I've yeah. Found a left back. Yeah, looking at left back. Yeah, we'll look at transfers in between. Um, I'm still thinking about it. Things are going well, but I know you're capable of even better. Yeah. Just, you know, they're, they're playing well, but we'll give them a bit more confidence to let them know that you can do more. Tara Mings loved That's it. That's very David Brent. <laughs> yeah. uh, I'm happy to jump straight in. Um, Douglas Louise, ease off tackles on a yellow, red card, waiting to happen. No, um, McKinnon's knackered as well. That's a problem. It's just this time of year. It's January, isn't it? Oh, I've oh, no. to start. Um, I've run him into the ground. How many hours a day do you play this, Dan? That's directed to you. I'm not prepared to answer that question. <laughs> I'm not you're sure he's watching. watching. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm not sure he's watching. Uh, I've been trying to get Steam installed on my work Mac instead. I mean, it's Don't flexed, tell Mac so Kendrick that. Oh, Mac Kendrick's no, not your boss anymore, is it? It's allowed anyway. The people at work know that we do this. So it's, not, it's not a secret. Um, the other guy is your boss now. I forgot his name. Yeah, Steve. Steve was watching one of the last episodes, so the other I don't guy. know it's happening. He'd be pleased um, with that. But my work Mac is a lot more powerful than this one, so I'm trying to get it installed on there. But IT have said that Steam and Football Manager are not company-approved applications, so I'm having difficulties it's getting work. I know, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm I'm fighting my corner as best I can. Uh, John McGee wants to come off, by the way. His fitness is shot. Um, We're gonna have to try and do something clever. Uh, I don't know what. I'd just go to a number ten or put Brendan well, central midfield. Uh, then who? But then then who are we gonna put on the wing? We have to get Danny Ings on. Yeah. You met that with silence because you, you, maybe this is his day. So bring, I, let's bring Ings on. It's a bit attacking though when we're winning, isn't it? But yeah, play him there. Like that. Yeah, get the ways as a defensive though. Oh, sorry. Yeah, central midfielder defend. That's fine. No, no, that's what we want. I think okay. again, right. don't uh, don't overcomplicate it. But you don't have Ings as an attacking midfielder like that. He was shadow striker, wasn't he last time? I think. Yeah. Yeah, he didn't do anything. I did. But... No, no. I think he might have. I'll got get back to support now as well. Now we've got someone attacking. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, 
Yeah, that's pull right. Do you want to pull cash backs? We're cautious, aren't we? I suppose three players attacking. That's okay. That's okay. Okay. Happy with that? Yeah. Well, I'm not happy with it, but there's not much we can do. I always forget to do the turn talk when you bring people Yeah, up. I do as well, but I'm just thinking of Danny Ings. He's, um needs to do more. So. I think we want to say a good performance from him because we haven't seen one for ages. Yeah. What can we do that's aggressive? Point the finger. Mm. Doesn't care. <laughs> <laughs> Does not care. Get on and score a goal, man. Uh, John says hi from sunny Torquay. Is it sunny? It's pitch black where I am. <laughs> I've got uh, no more just says, it's about Torquay. Yeah. You You've got more, did you time. say? No, I've oh, got none. Talking? I used them all last time. Um, Noel just says promote Aaron Ramsey. Uh, we'll I try. tried to, but you, you didn't want me to. Here we go. Cash on the overlap now. I'm actually playing, yeah. actually playing all right. Yeah, I told you we've, we've made little improvements. Where do those improvements start? <laughs> if you're being honest, if you're being honest Watkins, with yourself. Yeah. yeah! Get in. Ramsey That's, assist. Uh, Watkins has scored five goals in the last three or four games, I think. Love Danny that. Danny Ings could score. Love that. So to only have one player that can score at a time, it was Tyrone yeah. Mings, and now he's, now he's Watkins. I mean, he's better than his Watkins, I suppose. Oh, Jack I Ramsey doing, scoring as long as we score. Jack of Ramsey doing bits down the road. Yeah, to be fair, he was he was involved in one of the goals last episode as well. I think he set it up for somebody else. Holly Percival, who I think you know from... Uh, oh, I know Holly. It's my podcast partner. Yeah. So I heard that Dan sucks at Football Manager. I, have, I agree, Holly. I've heard Holly sucks at Rocket League. <laughs> here we go. On another attack here, by the way. El Ghazi at the back post. Um, we have got one more sub left, which probably should make it, but we'll, we'll give it no, a little bit I think we're okay at the moment. Oh, El Ghazi's looking a bit tired. Give, yeah, we'll give it Wait, a little there's, there's literally no one to bring on for him, though. Unless we've been ca- unless put Watkins out minutes. on the left and put him another midfielder oh, on, I guess. It's like, you, it's like you read my mind. <laughs> Got a good partnership, haven't we? Buendia was also struggling the one. Let's get Ashley Young. Ashley Young. Let's get Ashley Young on the wing instead of El Gaza. Um, Dennis You'll says, "Do you fin- think?" Sorry, Dennis says, "Do you what? think Danny Ings will work under Stephen Gerrard in real life?" Oh, I hope so. Gerrard knows him, doesn't he? Yeah. So let's hope so. Um, he wasn't was fully fit Garza, the weekend. Was also was it? struggling. Yeah, get so, El Gaza off for Young. Yeah. Pull Young back. Go isometric. No, 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 you've got to pull him back. I can't believe I got that word right, isometric. Isometric? What yeah. do you mean? Oh, yeah. Defensive defensive winger. Yeah, so I thought there was a role isometric winger or something you were saying then for a second. No, no, we've got the formation a bit isometric now. Um, God, I hate I'm the look of that, but... <laughs> it's, it's okay. It's fine. It's fine. We're, t- we're turning up at home to Spurs. Yeah. I mean, you, I've heard that your home games are like, is there's a genuine advantage to be at home on the game rather than, like in real life, it doesn't matter that much. Um, I want to shout take the tempo down, take the tempo down. Okay. People keep saying about um, shout at them more, but I can't now because I've done one thing. It doesn't want me to do all these things at once. Hold on. Tempo down. Okay. I'll shout at them mm. in a sec. <clears throat> Holly says, if there's another manager or change at Villa, we know who we can turn to. Yes, and I will step up to the job. Uh, Holly Percival. Oh, did you know that Holly started doing our podcast at 1074? And literally, as she joined, we just lost every single guy. <laughs> since she joined our podcast, we hadn't won until last week. Even the women's <laughs> team started losing. Like Everything we covered, everyone just started losing when Holly joined the podcast. Uh, Tom Mings, there's a lot of unhappy players here, by the way. Why is Mings, why is Mings unhappy? And Ramsey. Oh, in this and game? Dickers, and Young. Because they're tired. And Martinez. Oh, I don't know what in January? Do. In January, yeah, like January 5th or something. It's early. Maybe they're missing the players that are at AFCON. Oh, oh here we go. Oh, Watkins is going to get another hat trick. There again. Oh, his confidence is on flames at the moment. I'll tell you what. Love to see it, don't we? Rushton and Pat. <laughs> Absolutely cowering in the corner watching this. <laughs> I know that they're both busy tonight, but I hope they do catch up on this and see how it's actually done. I mean, this is... This is liquid this, football. You, you beat Norwich and we smashed someone else last time. This is Spurs. Yeah. I mean, Nuno might well be the manager here, which no, does he's not. He, he, no, he's um, not. It's, Bar- it's um, Barcelo. It's Marcelo Bielsa now. <laughs> Oh, he, he, this is this is his first game. He only joined uh, before this. Really? Oh, yeah. Bielsa's had a... They've only had three shots. I think Leeds are only... Oh, it's, oh, it's four. Oh, it's four my nil. days. Oh, my Tyro days. Tyro Mings again from a set piece. Oh, oh, might be offside, concert? though. Hold on a sec. Oh. Couldn't be offside. I actually had one earlier that got... that You know, they does a check and you feel like... It, oh, no, exactly the yes. same. Got awarded. Exactly the same. I think that's the first earlier. time that's happened. Yeah, they ne- that never... How many goals? Mings got five. Five, I think. 
<laughs> oh, God. John's rushing, he's watching, he says, what have you done to Watkins? They're just, I don't know, carry a bit of confidence. And literally, when you said about telling him to shoot less, he's been better since then, which is absolutely bizarre. Oh, I told him to shoot less. Yeah, you said his instructions was shoot more often, and we took that off, and since then he scored two hat-tricks. There we go. Which is ridiculous. Oh, it's, going be, it's going to be another one. Spurs are all over the place. Ings. Oh, oh he just can't wanted. score, can he? He just cannot score. Oh, somebody should have said, throw them all a quick praise shout. Go on then, quick. Oh, I don't encourage. <laughs> I've lost my head. So, <laughs> Oh, we're encouraging them for the 3 0 up, 4 0 up. It's a clean sheet. Keep the clean sheet. That's what I wanted. Oh, this is great, this vending. Get rid of it. Blow the whistle. That was very Keith from the office, that was. Can you just remind me of the options? They never change. <laughs> I don't know why they're all, the morale is all, everyone is unhappy. I don't know why. Look at this. Oh, I love that. I'll tell you what. No, I, I, think that's as good for the, I think that's as good as he gets. So Even he just, just came so on we, and got a seven. So we just stop this room? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> it's only downhill from there, isn't it? It doesn't get better than it. Um, outstretched arms for sure, giving everyone hugs like Klopp. Outstretched arms. That's about as comprehensive it gets. You've blown oh, away. Yeah. Like, I mean, our goalkeeper was carrying a knock and he hasn't had to do anything. Oh, unbelievable. Holly says, I hate to say it, but I might actually need some football knowledge lessons from you you guys. Uh, Danny says, Danny says, fall in love and they're all livid. Yeah, I don't know what. That might have been a bug or something because they're all happy at the end. Um, James Russian says, I take it all back. Jack says, not a bad day at the office. Unbelievable. Love to see it, don't we? Bielsa's first game ends in disappointment. He looks really cross. Um, post much press. So, Roy King, have a field day, say what you want. Okay, so you'll still be not happy. We just paid two million pounds for Watkins. That's not good news. That's come out of the budget. It's got twenty goals for Villa. It's an expensive hat trick that was for us. We could have done with that after January when he doesn't come out of the budget. Oh, Keenan Davis also since the last stream eventually went out on loan to Wickham. He rejected all the championship offers that came for him. Um, to Wickham and he didn't lost play well. Against, yeah, lost against Sunderland, didn't play well. So Jonathan Wilson will be absolutely delighted after <laughs> times. Um, again, and his little jaded and could do with the rest. That's popped up over the last couple of games, so we probably do need to, to get rid. Um, oh, love that. Let's praise him. Uh, top one, done. Yeah. Very happy. Um, Villa maintaining, yeah, five five in a row without losing. Now I mean, we've scored four goals in three games. Uh, it's four goals three times, which is weird. We, we weren't scoring at one point. At yeah, all. I know. Oh, Leicester. Let's have, let's have a look at that little green dot. Looks like Leicester have got a lot of players missing. Look at this. Four wins out of six. In the you know, four out of five wins in the league. That's impressive. Come on, let's have a bit of credit for us there. We've, we've turned things right. I mean, I'm just going to point out for people that might be new for the stream when I joined. <laughs> so I joined on the 20th. Yeah. That was Chelsea. my first game, Chelsea. There's only three defeats in that time since I came in and did some surgery. Yeah, and we should have beat Liverpool. We could have oh. potentially beat Man United. We could have got a draw against Arsenal. And then the rest in those, of the is... Uh, in right. those tight games, that was when Watkins couldn't hit a barn door. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, now look at him absolutely flying. Um, <laughs> KG press conference with Roy Keane. Considering how well things are going, do you fear the effects of complacency? He says, I'm not prepared to answer that question. <laughs> Why? Why did he say that? And don't ask Roy Keane silly questions. Uh, any chance of Rico Henry in at left back says Moldy789. Uh, you said you had a left back in mind. Who is it? I can't remember his name, but he was at Stuttgart. He was Croatian. Uh, we looked at him. I've not loaded the Bundesliga. Sosa, I want to say. Yeah, he's not he's in not it. You've not loaded the Bundesliga? Didn't load it by mistake. <clears throat> I've, I've added it in, but it's only active from the summer transfer window. So we can't get him in January. God knows it. Okay. Can I just give you my midfielder that I took a photo of earlier? Yeah, go for it. You send it to me. I think he's, he's the type of midfielder we need. You know, cancel that Villar loan. It's too expensive. I can't cancel the loan. Maybe. Um, a couple of comments. I might be wrong. Says Bardell is back, our saviour. I mean, can I get any like tiny little bit of credit here that I'm also participating in these victories? It's not all Dad doing this. We're doing it together. Uh, Captain Greeny says uh, the team. Oh, that's a terrible name, Greeny. Uh, the team shouts are very crucial during matches. Your players' red faces morale are because you're making the wrong shout. Fair, fair enough. Praise lots if winning, encourage lots when losing. Fair enough. Okay. So when I encouraged them in the last few minutes and they were already winning 4 0, they took umbrage with that. Fair enough. Um, have you got this midfielder for me? I just did. I'm just at Maidy oh, Camera. Have you, send, have you sent it to me? No. I could have done that. C A M A R A. Oh, you won't be. He's not the one I want. He's not the one I want, but oh, he's not there, is he? 
Who's he playing for? You've not got the French league loaded. I know Olympiacos. Olympiacos. I've got like I think I've got France, Spain. That might be it. <laughs> I'm absolutely bewildered, but I've got another one. But he's going to be too expensive. You looked at him last time. Backer. He's going to cost too much, and I don't think he'll come to Villa. Uh, Wolfsburg. Rid, Riddle backer. 108 million to 178 million. Oh, I've is got him uh, in my save. It cost, it cost me about 30. So we just put an offering of 13 to see what they say. We haven't got 30 million. No, nah, but we can sell somebody if he comes. Trouble is, once you offer 30, we can't afford that. They don't. They don't. Oh, wow, they, 119 million. 119 and then 108 in instalments. A total uh, value of 227 million. Wolfsburg wants It's a bit out of our reach. Just Even a bit. bit. Even with the Jack Grealish money, we can't afford that. Just a bit. Uh, still waiting on Todd Cantwell. Do we want to do any training? Because I know that you're hot on sorting the training after every game. What I want to do is, stuff. what I want to do is, you should give them some time off because they're all knackered. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. You want to go in and look at who's like coming to the end of their contract. You know, I don't know if Cantwell will be. Personally, yeah. I think you're overpaying for Cantwell. What, January, eight million? But he's out of contract in six months. You get one for it. Yeah, but he'll go somewhere else and be worth fifty. No, no, but I just he's not what we need. We've no, already got Ben Dyer, really but it is a good. I still think that's a good transfer. Would be in the summer. I don't think it's right now. We need a midfield. I need a, a proper central midfield. I don't grade on the camber. Trezeguet is fit again. I thought he was still injured. He's away. He's bloody, yeah, he, no, he, but it's still said injured when he went away. But he's played fifty-four minutes for Egypt and lost four-one. Um, it's back in real life, isn't it? Yeah. He's back training, yeah. Tottenham have been on a good run as well, I think. What, they got new managers? No, they haven't. I was wrong. <laughs> I was wrong. <laughs> Way wrong. Um, they're harsh for their managers to get the sack, unless he got the sack early doors. Yeah. I'm sure what, Bielsa's only just been there. Yeah, hardest Tottenham manager, 2022, we're in hmm. January 2022, so he's literally just gone there. I'm sure that was his first game. Um, a question for you both. Does the salt or vinegar go first on chips? Vinegar. I do salt. Is the correct answer because then the salt, salt sticks to the vinegar. The vinegar would I dissolve don't... the salt if the salt went Unless first. I have chips from the chippy, I don't put vinegar on my chips. Oh, I only with the chipper. Strange. Uh, what's the table looking like, says Dennis? Good question. Um, 13th. 13th. Yeah, it was congested up here and we were miles away. Like We were like... 13 points for a long time. We've we've shot up, but this bit was all congested. Another win takes us into the top half, potentially. I mean, the relegation worries have been eased. Yeah, 100%. How far are we? We're only 11 points off 7th now, which isn't massive. You say that like 11 points is nothing. That's quite a lot. Yeah, but it's not 20 like it was a few weeks ago. If you were 11 points from safety, you'd think, no, we're probably going to get relegated. You're not catching, <laughs> you're not catching that. Uh, Yanazai might be out of contract, says Brad. What I want you to do is, I want you to go to scouting. Top spelling. Thank you. I mean, it's literally written on YouTube for me to copy. No, he's got a new, he's got uh, new contract. He's got. Uh, go on then, scouting. Uh, Filthy Daniel says, well done, Dan Rights, for clicking the buttons. I mean, it's an important job. Someone's got to do it. That's Lewis, Lewis Cook's available for cheap there. He's always good in football manager. Mm, is he any better than the guy we've just signed? The deep line of playmaker? Probably not the type of midfielder that we need. We need a, I can't swear, we need a brick meat house. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, okay. In um, the midfield. I think um, Basuma went to Bayern Munich, by the way, last episode. Uh, so what do you want me to do here? Like, how, Ryan Sessegnon's not a bad shout. Yeah, I looked at him, potentially on loan. I don't want loans. Oh, you got to do what you got to do. You gotta, they want 28 to 46 million for yeah, him. Okay. We don't, don't have that. It's not a priority, but because he can cover the two positions. He's out of contract. Go, we're not getting soon of him. You know, he's not coming to us. I'm just, I'm just looking at comments now. Uh, you can send a scout out to find end of contract signings. You might find a steal. Victor Wanyama says Moldy. Football manager 2016. <laughs> is it Montreal? Yeah, he's not good enough, is he? He's only 30. I got surprised. Thought he'd be older than that. Not what we need. He's not got the pace. He won't have the, won't have the pace that we need. Sander Berg? I'm not sure about him. Is there an A on the end? Yeah. yeah. 
30 to 48 is his value. That's a lot of money. Sheffield United dream, sat the managers there, haven't they? Yeah. I wonder what that means for Aran. It's good for him because he's played under the manager that's taken over, Barsler. Yeah. Yeah. Good, good knowledge. Thank you. Um, so we want to go back and look at players with a filter of... How do I create this? Is it going to work? Anthony or... Robinson, Robinson, someone I always look at for Fulham. He's a left back. He's young. I wanted to sign him at the time because he was one million, and I felt we needed a back at left back. So these players are contracted to Buffon. Do <laughs> Bale fancies a go? Thought we didn't need a winger. And that's just fun, though, isn't it? To sign someone <laughs> like that. He's on five hundred thousand pounds a week. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there's a broach. Just approach him, see, just see what he says. For a laugh. Scott, let's give him a star want, player. Yeah, he only wants to be a squad player. That might tempt him. Keep him down as a squad player because then he'll want less money if he's only a squad player. Okay, all right. I didn't know that. Uh, come on then. Why is he so bad? Why, don't, why is he that bad? 180k. Oh, Gareth. We can afford 130. We so... don't need him to waste the money. Perslow wouldn't let this go through. Yeah, but let's just see if we can knock him down. <laughs> if you can sign Gareth Bale. Oh, my God. Then you sign oh. Gareth Bale. No, you don't. It's not till next season anyway, but we might be able to get him cheap. We might be able to say, Let's, we'll do this now. Uh, use the filter and player search to find players. Yeah, doing that. Uh, that's better than Campwell. Michael Bradley. Michael, I like Michael Bradley. I did, oh, football manager years and years ago. Michael Bradley was absolute boss yeah. in central midfield for me with Charlie Adam for Fulham. Great central midfield. He's 34, though. Yeah, that's not what we need, is it? No. Uh, my mouse has stopped. Although, we, although we are about to pay Gareth Bale, he's not far off that. <laughs> I just think that's for a laugh, Gareth Bale. What Imagine that? what it will do for shirt sales at Villa Village. Why well, is my mouse just stopped working? Oh, huh. that's not good for a stray. It's back, it's back. Also, can we get the recruitment package away from UK and Ireland to the top one? What oh, is going on? I don't on? know. It's just default. We've not done any of this. That's more money oh, gone. God. Yeah, but you'll get better players come up. Yeah, well... Look at that. Look at that. It's already adding. Look how many players it's adding. Yeah, but... Oh, all right, fair enough. Um... <sighs> I don't want to. I want to look at central midfielders. Not class any. Okay, all right. I'm just clicking. Just clicking. Edit search. Right. Edit search. Central midfield. I thought you said left back. Well, I, I, I'm obsessed that we need a central midfielder. Although Ramsey came in and did a good job. I'm not convinced we need one now. I feel like that. Into that Zakira play for Switzerland. I recognise him. It would be funny to sign Gareth Bale. Yeah, of course it would. But are we here to have fun or are we here to be serious? A bit of both. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can't imagine Perslow's going to sign that check. Oh. Cheeky He's 34. We're not going to go sign loads of old people. Uh, Cockerlan? No, he's no better than the Camber. Who's told you to do that? I'm going through comments now. He's better than the Camber, I'd say. It's going to cost too much for 30 years of age. It's all for all, all japes signing Gareth Bale. Mark Noble? <laughs> no. Let's Danny, just leave it. Danny Drinkwater back from the dead. <laughs> now we're talking. Oh, God. Red is. Yeah. Not living in there. Okay, let's uh, just move on. Yeah. The Conga. I think he'd be too expensive. The Villa fans are starting to get excited about Gareth Bale. They've cited him. And, and the Belfer. Zakaria. Uh, would you I'm rather go back in time or look into the future? Me? Yeah. No, I was just asking out loud. Well, on Football Manager or no, just, just in general? No, just in life. I mean, what 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 use would that have on Football Manager to look into the future or go Has back someone in asked time? that? Yeah, it's, I'm, I'm not just saying probably it. Go, I'm reading off the comments. Probably go back in time. Really? Why? Do, things, do a few things different there, yeah. Hmm. I think I'd rather... The not, would, I still have the not, would I have the knowledge that I've got now? I'm going to say no, just to make it more interesting. Oh, it's no point me going back in time. Uh, I think if you went back, you wouldn't be able to change things either. You just have to observe the same things happening again. Just live them again. Mm. So what's the point? Mm. Um, does anyone know if this guy was any good? No. Is it? He can is go. It's a transfer offer. Yeah, no one cares. He's worth 600 quid, 800 quid. Never going to play as a... Romeo is not a bad shout. I think I'm worth more than that. We can't afford Romeo. I'm just looking. Yeah, he's not even that expensive. To be fair, he's out of contract in between. That is a good shout for a bit of a bruiser. He's slow. Let's see if he's available. 
slightly interesting. Okay, very interesting. Uh, no, not 16 to 21. Yeah. Yeah, we don't need him. And it, let's just quickly go in. No. Just we, haven't got the, we haven't got the finances. Are you trying to sign Todd? Oh, We're no. still signing Campbell. Honestly, I don't know what Todd Campbell is buying at. I, was I don't want him with this attitude. I don't want him with this attitude. I mean, if he's not desperate, I don't want him to come anywhere. With... Oh, here we go. <laughs> Aston Villa are off a bail contract. I mean, if if a player isn't desperate to come and play for Aston Villa, do we want him? Is would be my Who's... question. Because if we if we this offer gets accepted for bail, then we're going to get him in now. We're going to play around with a nominal fee, and we're going to get him in now. Uh, yeah, that's what we're. Oh no, we're we're um, doing it for the summer, aren't we? I think. No, but you can. As soon as you sign someone, you can. Change it. I've uh, got you. And okay. you can ask them to to have to, you'll pay a fee now to have them now. What are uh, they sniffing around Eddie Martin? Yeah, they sniffed around Conta as well last episode. They put an offer in of like fifty million, and we said a hundred million or something silly, and then they came back saying no. But they've come back again. We'll look at that in a sec. Aaron Ramsey out on loan to Rotherham. We all right with that? Just to get into play. Important <laughs> game time in League he's One. In, I think he's in and around the first term. Check the manager in the working with Aaron Ramsey. School. Not Jacob. Had, Ramsey's not playing had, for us. Yeah, we had Timothy. What's his face on the bench in the last game? Yeah. Who is better than? Paul Warren's the manager. 12 working with youngsters. Mm. Is he not be an important player there? He'll play in League One. Go on in. I think that's worth it. Go on in. Let's speak to him as well. Yeah, well, he follows uh, me on Twitter, so we've got to speak to him. I encourage you to make the most of this loan. If you impress, you'll have all sorts of options at the end of it. Fine. Mm. Cool. Off you go. It's only six months, I think, anyway. Um. Might Good as well get Aaron him. Ramsey to join it with Bale. Yeah, the other Aaron Ramsey. I wonder what he's up oh, to. We're just, um, let's get James Chester back as well. Have a real Welsh reunion. 6.2 million, 175 a week. That's not, that isn't terrible. He's available, pretty much. We're just signing third pensioners, though. Yeah, but if it's, if it's a quick fix that falls us up the league into Europe, so oh, it's this is worth right. it. Are you Martin O'Neill? <laughs> Uh, oh, he doesn't want to join Aston Villa under any circumstances. Oh, Fair enough. Fine. Fair enough. Uh, really confusing having two Aaron Ramsey's as well. 63 million. I mean, it's a, uh, I'm not going to accept it, but that is more than he's worth on game, apparently. Uh, 50 million so up front. Want, so we want eight. We'll say eight up front, and I'm going to keep that the same as well. So a total value of 93 million. Just suggest suggest terms because it doesn't. 55 and 50. I mean, I'm not going to accept this. 70 million. No, but it's. I mean, he's 29. That's a good age for a goalkeeper. Everyone knows that. True. Yeah, we've got a long time left with him. We'll try that. Eight. Or oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Reject that. <laughs> <laughs> I've been playing with fire there. The only problem with that is now Martinez might come to us and say, uh, "I wanted to." He go. won't want to go. To, he won't want to go to Newcastle. Um, we can't afford Todd Cantwell now. <laughs> so. I told you he didn't have that budget. I <laughs> know. It's because you spunked all your money on that waste of time in, in midfield on low. Well, you said a midfielder was more important, so... Um, yeah. I'd rather we had Campwell than the waste that you bought in the middle of the park. Really? It's taken off after half an so hour. So, a winger that you don't even want, you'd rather have than midfield that we did actually have, but we wanted a midfield in the first place. That, I'm upset because that wasn't done on my watch and I would not have Well, this is, this is what's going to happen when we do things together, isn't it? We're not all on the side. Like, James might be fuming that we've just cancelled the, the Campwell deal. Got, so. We've got magic up £5 million, pounds, James. Yeah, but we could have sold somebody. I think El Ghazi will want to transfer this, by the way. Yeah, unless we had Jimmy Carr's tax man, there's not much we could um, do. It's financial advisor. The conversation that you missed last episode, but I'll get you to answer the question in a sec. Uh, Dow says, Dan, did you actually go and check the size of swans? And if, that, if so, were they five foot? I did see a couple of swans in the canal by me yesterday, and they're tiny. So They're not five foot. Make that what you will. The question was, would you rather fight 10 Barry Bannon-sized swans or ducks? We changed it to swans, and Barry Bannon's five foot six, I think. So we said, oh, well, that's, that's quite hard. Or one Tyro Ming-sized dog. And I said, oh, it depends nah, what breed it is. The dog would finish, yeah. Yeah, it's one dog versus ten swans. Like, it's only one fight rather than ten. True, so, but it depends yeah. on the dog. The dog could finish you. I don't think the swans could. And then James and Pat were saying that and they Googled it and apparently swans are five foot tall. And no, I, re- I just reputed that, if that's the right word. I was just like, no way. Absolutely no I way. Don't think this, I think this dispute might be the Disputed, right word. Disputed, that's the word. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so no, I haven't actually gone to check, but I did see one and five foot. I don't know they're not five foot anyway. I didn't need to go and check it. That's ridiculous to even think that. So yeah, I still think I'd fight one dog rather than ten swans. 
just because I'd rather fight. It's easier to fight one thing than it is ten, is it not? I saw Barry Bannon in it and the night out once. I tried to buy him a pint and he didn't need money. Fair enough. Uh, Melberg sings Watkins praises. He was very critical of us. I was all off Melberg in previous times, but he's, he's changed his tune. Uh, Hull seek loan deal for Jake or Ramsey. Absolutely no, thank not. Thank you, Hull. Cardiff want Cole Palmer. I don't know why we've we told, told that. Told about that. I don't know. Do we have we offered him a contract before? I don't think so. I think no, we might. Be, be on our shortlist. I think he was scouted yeah early on. Uh, Hull want Jake or Ramsey. Reject. Because no, sir. Don't even care. Well. Also, Feeney. Um, We've got a lot of offers for him. Yeah, we've got a lot of offers from West Ham off for like three million or something, but we said no. Because he's actually he's quite good, yeah. So we'll be keeping him around. Uh yeah, I wanted a photo of a five foot swan. Yeah, this uh, next time I go and I'll see him off, take a photo and they're like they're tiny. Absolutely tiny. Holly Jennings guys have to go. If I don't, I could be in big trouble. Yeah, go. I'll be on here to watch on demand if you want. (laughs) Yeah, catch up. Yeah, you can watch this on demand. Um how much do they want from Romeo? Thirty eight, forget it. Pretty much press conference, Roy Keane, go and do the business. And we've got Leicester next. Do we want to Back change story. anything? Or it seems um, stupid to change anything considering we just want oh my god, Gav oh, Bell no. wants to come. Yeah, do it for a laugh. <laughs> I've got to tweet this out, haven't I? Uh well, accept it first. Okay. As if we're about to sign Gareth Bale, then that is ridiculous, <laughs> isn't it? I mean, wait, his, back? his current might, contract is 525k and he's got 130 for us. It's a two year deal as well, by the way. He's only 32. Like, Owner. Yeah, but I mean, Ashley Young's 36. That's true. It's confirmed. Ashley Young's going to be blind for us because my dog is injured. Uh, do you want me to just do a tweet? I've got no one else to do my social media for me here, so you have to bear with me while I do it. Is Gareth Bale on Twitter? Mind. I'm not going to tag him. <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> Okay, done. I did say actually about whether we should have a dedicated football manager Twitter because me no. tweet no, I know that. I know it sounds silly, but me just tweeting from the official account we've just signed Gareth Bale is it's confusing, isn't it? I also I tweeted earlier today. I run a fixture saying oh, we've got an FA Cup game against Brentford coming up, and someone said, "How oh, we got an FA Cup game already?" I was like, "Oh, it's football manager." But there is some confusion. I did say that. Yeah, tight thought he might be back. Mm-hmm. If he's back, he's going to be ready. To... His I, think, head off next to me. I think Ash Young is. Um, he had a couple of games at left back for us, and he was all right. So, right there, we need to. What have we done with Bale? We need to go in and get that right now. Click on him. Buy now. Bottom right it says. Oh uh, yeah. Well, how much we got to buy? One million. Just. Oh yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that's pocket change for Aston the Villa. Son Bale. I love that. <laughs> Absolutely love that. Uh, I'm going to screenshot it for later. <laughs> get him in the squad. Oh, uh, yes, the exciting bit, giving him a squad number. <laughs> I mean, the squad number is all yours. Where is he? Yes, what have we got going on? Where is he? Not going to be any good ones left. Uh, what he can wants, I see? There he is. He wants he's 11. There, he, he can't have that. You have nine. Oh, nine, like yeah. a Spurs last season. Nine Spurs, yeah. Done. <laughs> Gareth Bale. Wesley's seen a club brew, so <laughs> I was coming back. That's my number. <laughs> Unbelievable. Um, Bale set to sign for Aston Villa. Uh, no one cares about the budget. One million deducted from the budget of three point one. So we have a look, another look at him again. Yeah, free kicks, heading, long shots, crossings, good. Concerned by work, concerned yeah. by work rate and pace, but yeah, but oh, even so, we're going to have to carry him. If you get the opportunity to sign Gareth Bale in this year's version, like this year, you know, January this year, if someone said you can have Gareth Bale in real life, you'd be all for it, would you not? Well, I'm presuming that like anyone can sign him in football manager as we've managed to. True. Uh, let's get him in there. Get straight to my tactics. El Ghazi, get out of there. No one cares. Oh, no, he's, can't, he's not left. He's not playing left hand side. What's going on? We haven't he's, registered he's him registered. Yet. Where is that? He ain't playing left midfield for us. That's an absolute fact. Uh, registration. See, so we've done this, but we've not really considered the wider ramifications of. Yeah, but you, it's Garth Bale, so you don't do. You just have to. You have to sign him all costs. Uh, a question for you both. For us. How are you doing in fantasy football? Oh, I've given up. All right. Pretty well. Oh, I yeah. am. I don't know what, I don't know how, how do I gauge well? Like, what do I... <laughs> Where are you in your respective league? Are you near the top or near the, near the bottom? It depends. I'm in a few leagues. I've, I've not even checked mine for a couple of weeks, so I don't know what's going on. I mean, overall in the world, I'm under 1.2 million, if that makes sense. 
Uh, it doesn't. Where do you want to play Bar then? Left midfield? Are we going to are we going no, 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 four one? Like that. No, no, no. What guy who are we playing? Are we playing now? It's Leicester next year. It's I'm just getting ready. It's the game is today, yeah. We can put Algarzi on the bench instead of Timothy. Yeah, that's fine. What's his fitness like? I presume he's not been playing. Fitness might be dead. No, it's fine. Yeah. He's not fine, is he? Yeah. How, what, can, can you not say the red thumbs down? Yeah, that's morale. Oh, no, I know he's in sharpness. Okay. Yeah, well, I don't think we, even so. Well, he's playing in the FA Cup. We're not starting him in the league. Okay. He'll be on the bench. He'll be on the bench. Oh, guys, he did well. We won 4 0. Yeah, Harsh. no, I was just about to say there's no point changing anything. Target is. I'd get Ramsey in for Villar as well. So, I mean, Villar's really? Like... Ramsey got an assist. Villar was yeah, dead. Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. It was just I've central got, midfield, wasn't it? Support. I've got problems with Villar. You've signed him, and I don't want him. Yeah, so... well, you've got to get over that because he's here now. Put Ballot left back. Can we start Ballot left back? No, we cannot because we'll get murdered. He doesn't fancy it anymore. No, I'm not doing that. Target <laughs> will be fine. He, why does he not like it? Because he's, he's, he's 32 and he's an attacker. Uh, where's tackling and stuff? Nine. Okay. <laughs> he's, I mean, he isn't a left back. Yeah, I know, but he's, he's done it before. Ashley Young's going to play there. Yeah, that's fine. We can't Young's... play Bale and Ashley Young down the flanks. Young's been all right for us in the games that he's played. Uh, I'm watching on a delayed stream. You've just smashed Spurs. Yeah. Smashed it. That's what we, that's what we do. I'm keeping the rest the same. Uh, we're at home, but... Go standard, though, instead of cautious. Yeah, there's no reason to change anything. Continue onwards. Do we still want to play with more discipline? I guess it's working. Yeah, it's working. I mean, Leicester are sick. So this is still a difficult game. Are we playing a high line? Because that might be problems against Varda. Yeah, I can change that now. Hmm. Poor Villar in Bardell's bomber squad when he's done nothing wrong, precisely. You're judging him too hard have, because he wasn't your idea. He should never have been signed. And I assume James is going to come back next week and say, why have you spent all that money on Gareth Bale? £1 million? Pounds. Yeah, big wages though. But we've got wingers all the way. Will people leave, Jack? Can we do something to stop people just bidding for him and say he's not, not available for loan? Yeah. Um, can't you do like reject all offers or something? Yeah, there we go. Feeny impressive on the under 18. I heard you say the bit I did watch of your last stream. You said that you followed, you say followed someone, you followed Claret and Blue, or he followed you. Yeah, he followed James or something. I think he's got a following spree. He followed me as well. Expected. Well, no, but you know, it'd be good if he makes it. <laughs> yeah, sure. I'm sure that, I'm sure that contact will definitely come in, come in handy in the future, won't it? Hopefully. Um, give that a retweet. That's a marquee signing, even at his age. Uh, playing Ings as a poacher might work. Yeah, I think we did try at poacher, didn't we, at one stage? He's got more <coughs> about his game than being a poacher. Yeah. But Watkins is the number nine, isn't he, at the moment, because he's scoring goals. And we can't play to up front. Young and Bale as roving fullbacks. <laughs> Trust the process. Ro- I think it might be roaming, not <laughs> roving. <laughs> oh, he's ro- uh, roving. Is I think roving is allowed. Who's injured now? Shapok. Uh, Keenan Davis. What's he up to? Came came off the bench to show some brief glimpses of quality. On the bench for Wickham. That's not good. Yeah, I know. Aaron Ramsey showed a touch of quality in the short period of time he was does off the bench. Mean, does that mean Akin Fen was playing ahead of him? Uh, but we can possibly look, quick look. Vokes. Uh, so, Sam Vokes. Sam Vokes played for Wickham. That can't be. I thought he played for Stoke in real life. I think he left Stoke. Did he? Uh, no, yeah. he's joined him in the game. I think. No, I think that's real life. Is it? Okay. Oh, well, he has played twenty-four <laughs> games. Yeah. Stoke played seven million pounds and then let him go for an undisclosed fee to Wickham. That's not Where? Nice. I can. I don't think I can find that Wickham anymore. Isn't it? I don't think so. Is he still playing? On a free? Yeah. Uh, that could have been an in-game transfer. I don't know no, at this point. I think that's probably real life as well. Uh, but yeah, Davis not going to look in, so definitely not going to get a look in for us. Uh, don't well, essentially, things. Bale's replaced him in our squad now. Yeah. Dal says, on top of every league, this is uh, fantasy football, and always won my money league. What's your overall rank, Dan? I'm 33,000th in the world at the moment. Yeah, I think I'm 1.1 million. 
yeah, not doing Did well I say he was really good at football manager earlier as well? Or so? Is he the guy who said Ings had got like 18 goals or something? Yeah, well, there's a lot of experts out there, isn't there? I think they're doing doing great. <laughs> well done, Dale. Doing well everything. <laughs> um, Brian are probably going to get relegated, aren't they? Yeah. Newcastle in the bottom three, Palace as well. Newcastle have just been smashed 5 0 by Burnley. Yeah, that 1 1 draw with Newcastle doesn't look brilliant, does it? For us. No, I'm disappointed with that. Yeah, but we were losing, so that would have been a lot worse. Um, I'm really Vardy hoping. isn't even playing, or expected to play anyway. Dakar's playing, or Brighton on the right, looking on the left. Oh, just looking at that and then looking at my left as I have, and my team is just completely different. <laughs> um, we will. We will drop the high, the line down a bit. Yeah, Dak is fast as well. Yeah, that's fine. I think. You know. Nice though. I'm happy to keep exactly the same because we just won four 0 So why change it? Bale might get a cameo, mightn't they? Yeah. Um. I might be wrong. Says so roving definition: constantly moving from one area or place to another. Yeah, I just know it's it's roaming in this though. The so. roaming playmaker role. You'd have a roving reporter, wouldn't you? What's McGinn's fitness? McGinn's McGinn's fitness doesn't look great to me. No, he's wanted to rest for ages. Um, oh, it's not now though. Come on, Villar. This is your time. Oh, no, he's not a box to box. Uh, no, he's I'm happy with him being on the left of central midfield. That's got, got legs. That is. I'm happy with that. Is Villar particularly legger? Yeah. Was it? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Chris Boyle. <laughs> Chris Boyle says Bardell's been playing this game for at least twenty years. I'm expecting yeah, yeah, some excellent knows, insight. Man. Yeah, he's he not, knows, not true about last bit though. No excellent insight on this show. Um, he is lacking shots, so he's going to have to come off at some point. Probably still got McGinn for... on the bench. Uh, yeah, I don't tell you he didn't put McGinn on the bench. He must have done. Yeah, straight as well. More by more by luck than judgment. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Uh, it's a bit. <sighs> yeah, no Vardy's on the bench. Good. Okay, for Tottenham either. Watkins should be, we should be getting a Vestergaard and Evans with Watkins because they're both slow. Yeah, how do we do that? Vestergaard must be one of the slowest centre backs in the game. Um, exact revenge on Leicester. I don't know what happened. Yeah, we want some reven- a revenge mission. They would have beat us. I would have, I would have thought. Um, let's talk to Watkins. Oh, wrong button. Come on, pick up where you left off. Go out there and have yeah, fun. Pick up where you left off. Yeah, he doesn't really care about that. Can we do anything to make Watkins run more, or is that not a thing? I think we leave it for now. See how we start. Okay. Maybe we'll investigate after 20, 20 minutes or so. He might need some passing to space. Dal said, I never said I was amazing at it. I just said it's oh. the first time I ever bought the game, and I finished 10th with Villa and got to the League Cup final against Liverpool. That's, that's decent good, for your first time you've ever played. Season, yeah, yeah. I mean, the thing when people get this game for the first time, and like, it's very overwhelming with the amount of information, but you do get used to it. There's yeah, a lot when of I used you to, can skip if you want to. Like the first when it used to be called Championship Manager, the first one I played was so basic you couldn't do it. You just buy players, pick your team. Yeah, I think the first one I played properly was 2014 or 15. No, the first one I played was 97, 98. <laughs> I was barely even born. Were you born or were you not? No, I was born in 95. Uh, oh, here we go. Watkins is from goal again early doors. And at the moment, he doesn't. Oh, he has missed. <laughs> You're about to say at the moment, he doesn't miss. <laughs> he doesn't at the moment until then. Schmeichel's pretty good, though. In yeah. This. I'd, I'd be happy with this. Uh, I'm, loving what, it, I'm, loving, I'm loving the fact we've got Villar as the only man back. <laughs> when, we, when we've got corners, like, oh, what, what decision? What, how does that happen? I don't get <laughs> words out. I'm so <laughs> bewildered by that. Jacob says, what is this? Never seen anyone play with that layout. Put it to 3D. 2D is the classic for anyone who's been playing football manager for a long time. Yeah, when I started playing, we didn't even have 2D. We had text, text <laughs> only. But the thing is, we're streaming it, so it's difficult for my laptop to play it in 3D. We can put it to 3D and it will lag and everyone will stop watching because it's unwatchable. So Birmingham Mayor won't let him put it on his work laptop. Yeah, it's 2D or we don't do this. So The, the Stooge, is it Reach? Is it still Reach? Yeah. Yeah, the stooge is I mean, at Rage Pearson. Yeah, let's be careful with what you say here. <laughs> I can say what I want. I don't work for Rage Pearson. <laughs> no, you can't, because I'm liable for what you say. Oh, really? You should have yeah. told me that. Because you are. It's my, this is my responsibility. Here we go. Watkins is on goal. He doesn't miss at this stage. Yeah, I told you. Scored again. There's two chances for Watkins, yeah. one goal. Uh, I'm not having any Bardell slander, says Lemmings. He brings much needed experience to the coach himself. I agree. And we've also stopped throwing water bottles. I hope you've all noticed that. And, we're, and things have picked up since then. So the morale is much better in the dressing room. It's a great ball from Brendia, that. 
Has he been doing well? I can't remember. He wasn't really playing the last time I was. No, he's, Louise, he's, Louise, Louise loves a booking, doesn't he? He's been a bit hit and miss, Wendy. A couple of assists, I think. A lovely ball, though. Yeah, lovely. Good finish as well. Um, I mean, that's just standard what we've expected from Ronnie Watkins now. If we do, I mean, if we do manage to win this, we're on, we're on a great run, by the way. Uh, you can see how much I can say on this train. I thought mine's in a save, but <laughs> no, it just went wide. All bright against his old team, up against his former team, mate. Actually, young. <sighs> body's on the line. Squeaky bum time there. <clears throat> I'm comfortable. I, I feel quite comfortable. Yeah, so do I. Much more comfortable with the second goal. Cash, right side, ball in. Buendia, ball in again. Who's that? Mings. Right, shot Mings absolutely main, loves man. it. Oh, oh Tyro. Is that Tyro? Yeah. He absolutely oh, loves God. it. A bit of attacking play, doesn't he? Five goals is just such a good return in January for a centre. Yep. Oh, no, he's messed up defensively, though. I know where I go. Five goals on a I think he's got a couple of assists you, as well. Do you think his season, he's having this good season because he's known you from your previous body of work? <laughs> you, you've met. You've worked with Tyro Mings previously, haven't you? I know you don't like to go on about it, but you have worked. Oh, with I actually previous. don't go on about it. So I don't know what that snide remark was for. There's a, <laughs> a few times I've just been with you and you've just randomly got your phone out and said, I've got Tyro Mings' his number. I definitely haven't. That's definitely not happened. Um, no, it's nothing to do with that. Okay. He's just he's just a good player. Gets a lot of unfair, unfair stick in real life. Yeah, really he's my, my favourite player. Is he actually in real life? Yeah. Oh. A, oh my word! <laughs> what a strike! I don't know whether a thirty-six-year-old man should have a favourite player, but we, yeah, we, are, I mean, we are where we are. If you, if you support football, and you don't have a favourite player. What are you even supporting football? The problem is recently that my favourite player always leaves. Mm. Yeah, Mings is a good shout. I think Watkins might be mine. My last three favourite players have all left. I thought that was volleyball. That's a great header from El Ghazi. Yeah, you didn't want to play him. No, no, he's not been he's that good in the early players, days. Yeah. But, but to be fair, we just as a as a team weren't very good. We're at, on absolute fire at the moment. Another whole yeah, life in the Leicester area. The game's broken. That was happening. Well, I don't care. We're, we're absolutely sticking with it. But off the end of the area, <laughs> I'm desperate for him to do something. Oh, oh there he is. I'm, I'm catching that in the whole end. In my opinion, <laughs> uh, corners are a bit overpowered. Yeah, I think that'll probably get tweaked in an update at some point because it does seem that you score from most corners. A lot of goals from are scored from set pieces in real life. I don't know that yeah. they are overpowered. There's been, there's been a lot of set piece goals this season in the Premier League. Yeah, I've just seen a lot of people that say that you just get your tallest player to attack the front post and you'll score a few, and that's, that's what always we've done, been. But... I mean, that's what people do in real life. Yeah. As they knock I won't, one I won't say there was anything it. particularly overpowered in the games we've played. I mean, Mings has scored five goals, so. Oh well, yeah, here we go. What well, can you ping it around? Where's Villar? That's all I care about at this point. He... It's proving you wrong. I won't even celebrate if he scores. <laughs> so fickle. Um, people told me the game was addictive before I bought it, and it certainly is very addictive. Yeah, I assume you've lost a lot of late nights to this game over the years, especially in your uni days. Uh, I mean, I basically didn't do my dissertation because of football. <laughs> really. Yeah. Hopefully there's no kids watching. <laughs> and look don't where I am that. today. Don't take that advice. This is liquid football for most part. Right? Can we just it's appreciate just, what's going on? It's just so comfortable. Two and, yeah. and a half time against Leicester at home. But Leicester are sixth yeah. in this. You know, we'd have killed for this the first time I came on. Yeah, and now it's I, just like it's everyday life. When, in that first first stream, I don't know what the gap was. Obviously, we've got it on, I was gonna say on tape then, which makes me sound very old. But we can go back and check where we were in terms of the top six. We were miles off it. and it's better, sir. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Even in the last episode, we're still far away. We've got to make up some of that ground now. We could do without conceding a penalty on half side. That changes the whole face of the game. Yeah, change the team talk. Penalty awarded, oh, John Moss who, says. Who's taking it? Tillemans. Got a good pen, Tillemans. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> That's a blow right on half time. I mean, we'll get to half time, <laughs> hopefully. God, I've got to ask it because I've made me laugh so much. A question from Sam. He says, have either of you ever done a poo without doing a wee at the same time? Uh, 
That's nah, a great you point. You always do work. Have you not heard that before? Loads of people ask this and stuff like this. No, no, no I've never heard that You've before, heard but that. That is, it's a great shout. I don't think I've ever yeah, had true. a poo without ever having a wee. It must be true. something to do with the way he bum moves. <laughs> good, an- good analysis. <laughs> Thank you. Um, right, another question, we, just before we get through to half time. We didn't need that. Um, if Villa called you and said, we need you to play on Saturday, which position would you pick to play in? I mean, I'd be... Uh... I mean, the standard would be... Horrific. We'd definitely lose, even if I was playing. Just one. You know position. what? Pro- I think striker because at least if you're not doing well, you can always just say I'm not getting any service. Yeah. Anywhere I've... else you'd be anywhere else you'd be in trouble. Like full back, you need too much energy. Central midfield, you need too much energy. Yeah. Centre back, you could make an error. Goalkeeper, you could make an error. Maybe out wide, the... just, just hang out. Yeah, in the front. In the front, I'd put myself in the front three. My instinct I'd never do say, anything. My instinct was just to say strike because on the off chance that you're in the edge of the box. Uh, in the box goal hanging and it falls to you and you score you're the absolute hero and like you said if you don't do much you can just say well it's a difficult game for us I'm playing at Villa Park in my uh, yeah you've told me well, I'm telling the stream it's okay. interesting news isn't it <laughs> yeah, oh yeah I'm sure so it's just me and you you just want to to the audience <laughs> yeah fair enough sorry about that um, no, are we doing anything half time yeah? the majority of the first half was absolutely fine apart from that that penalty. Tell Villari, give Villar some stick. Six point six. That's not good. It's not good. Six point six. Six point six is absolutely average. Um, I think we're doing well, but can find another gear. I'm happy with that. Get out of there. Oh, just that goal on half top. It could be a Wolves collapse. Um, I used to stay up till four a.m. on Saturday night, Sunday morning, back in the day of the ninety four, ninety five version. I think that's where my life started going wrong. <laughs> I mean, in, in my defence, if I was playing a lot of football manager, I would at least go out on a Friday or a Saturday night. How mad is that? The 94 95 version that was the year I was born. Oh, that was even I didn't play that. Yeah, <laughs> someone says I've done a wee and then gone and done a poo without a wee 10 minutes later. I think it, I think I had a poo not long after a wee. I'd still have a little bit of a wee though. I mean, when you get to my age, you can weigh the best of times. <laughs> uh, I'm a little bit concerned that this isn't this isn't going brilliantly, but I mean, the second half's only four minutes old, yeah, but I'm. I've just got bad vibes from something. I could do with just sending Gareth Bale out to warm up just to get the whole end up. <laughs> be excited, won't they? I mean, the front, three, the front three are having a great time because I know Gareth Bale sat on the bench. We're only going to bring him on if we're losing. Here we go, Watkins. Oh, <sighs> could have done with that going in. There's too much poo chat in the in yeah, conversation. Chat now. That. I'm not mentioning it again. That's the last time. Uh, Alfie says, there. I'm 15, still playing this. Yeah, absolutely go for Fair it. Fair play. That's what I, I respect that a lot. So yeah, I, sometimes yeah, I, think I, that. I sometimes think at 36, am well, I yeah, too old to be doing you're stuff like 50, this? You're almost 50, aren't you? So that's fair enough. <laughs> Outrageous. <laughs> Get the grey hairs of a 50-year-old. I have. I have to have a skin fade every two weeks to hold the grey hairs. <laughs> just embrace them. Nothing wrong with I'd rather just hairs. go all grey. Oh, what a ball from Villar. He's over, overcooked it, hasn't he? Yeah. But he's, no, no he's good, trying. Man. He's trying. That's fair. He's no good. <laughs> Oh, I don't think we've lost a game since he joined, so... He's barely played. Stick that he up, yeah. ta- Oh, Watkins. He had to be taken off in the first... He could have feasibly come off in the first 20 minutes of the last game because <laughs> he was knackered. Yeah, he's doing all right now, though. He's had a little... I know he's not even playing. Oh, no, he is. <laughs> oh, God, I'm worried. In fact, you can't even remember if he's playing or not, does he? All. <laughs> I looked between Douglas and Ramsey, expecting him to be there, and didn't see him and panicked. No, he's doing all right. 6.7. That's all right. That's a, That's average. Things have just let us down there. Should... Oh, oh Dakis hit the post there. I think Things have let us down there. He let Madison bring it down. Uh, Championship manager 0102 was the best. 0304. Yeah, it's a good one. It's a good one. Uh, Gambetto. To be fair, I've seen a lot of recognisable names saying people are coming back. Now, I've played He's over a thousand mate. hours on uh, three different versions of football manager. Yeah, Fair play. That's, a, that's a low compared to some people. Uh, Rob Faulkner in capitals has put bail. I'm tempted to give him half an hour. Not half an hour too long with his level of fitness. For uh, top with I'm Wendy out, don't have, on don't have left anyone foot. else to play wide, though, do we, of course? Um, Mate, hmm. Cash is struggling a bit for huh? fitness, but he's, he's playing well. We've got a few people at Watkins, he's struggling. Yeah. Uh, we haven't got anyone to. Maybe Twan Zabi for Cash for now, just firm it up a little bit. Cash is playing well, though. But he's low on fitness. Mm, okay. Turns out will give us a bit of extra height from set for set pieces yeah, as well. Okay. Well, is that true? He's six foot one. Six foot. Mike Cash is six foot one. Uh, is he? 
Yeah, apparently. Uh, most of the play seems down the left. I don't know whether that's for or against. Um, I'll be tempted, not yet, but straight swap Brendy for Bale at some point is definitely happening. And maybe McGinn for Villar. It's just Bale when you're winning the games and not what you want because he hasn't got the work right. That's good. That Villar is just a complete. It's not a waste of time. He's a valuable squad time. player. All right. He's, he's just a, get off his back. All right. He's no good. He was a, the wrong signing. Oh, I don't agree. I think he's, he will do a job throughout the rest of the season and you'll eat your words. I bet you he never scores a goal. Uh, I'll, I'll bet you'll bet you the opposite. <laughs> He'll score at least one. Okay. There's actually no it's way I'll go the rest of the season and not score a goal. Mark my words. I mean, he has to play at some point anyway because we pay him too much not to play. <laughs> Is he always going to play? Well, not always, but at the minute we don't have a midfield, so there's no reason to suggest he doesn't play. Look at Mike Cash just walking off behind the goal. I've never seen that before. No, I haven't. It was nice to see it in 3D rather than to see a circle move up. But uh, Watkins has probably got to come off as well at some point because his fitness is low. We've only got one sub left. Uh, yeah, I want to get Bale on. We're not going to be able to see Gareth today. Can we play Bale up front? Fan... No, we're bringing Ings on if we bring the striker on. <laughs> Pardon me. Uh, question for you both. Do you prefer Domino's, Papa John's or Pizza Hut? Pizza Hut. I'd say Domino's, but Pizza Hut is good. I like, pizza. I like a stuffed crust from Pizza Hut. But... No. Mm. Uh, Dave, I mean, David, I, I don't know what you're talking about here because I'm, I'm not old enough, I'd, I would imagine here. He says, can we have some, some love for Sensible World of Soccer? Oh, what a game. I played that. Never even heard of it. That was a good game. What was that like? A, was that a PC thing or was that a Well, console? Sensible Soccer was the was the foot, like, the football game. It was like top-down view. It was like you could put so much swaz on the ball and then they got that, like a management version. He says, different kind of game, I know, but I lost months of my childhood playing that. Yeah, I've genuinely Soccer never heard of it. <clears throat> Sensible Soccer was the one. Oh, no, we need to, oh, we need to do something there. Um, the only thing Watkins I want can't. to do is Watkins for Ings, and that's not going to change it defensively. No, we can't tie Watkins off now. We can. No, no, we've got other priorities. Oh, no, yeah, he's, he's knackered. El Ghazi's knackered, and that's more people to track the fullbacks. Oh, God. I thought we'd already take off. No, yeah, Wendy's still there. We've got oh, one sub less. We've done McGinn and Tanzaiba. It's because she's that stupid Villar not being fit for purpose. Rob Crook says, FA, FA Premier League stars, anybody? Was it an AI Sports game, though? Never heard of that either. That was good. It was an AI Sports game, I think. Um, I was on Premier oh, Manager for the 92-93 season. Brilliant I've game. Done them all. I've done them all, I have. Never heard of that either. <laughs> I've done them all. I think my first FIFA was FIFA 03, maybe, or 02. We're in big trouble there. Um, okay, let's focus. Is Target fit? No, not really. This game is important to win. Um, yeah, Target's kind of fit, but left-back's not really a problem. No, oh, I know we could put Ashley Young where El Ghazi is again. Go we can put. Again. Can we not put Ings up front and Watkins on the left? I mean, it's not really solving anything, is it? Because Watkins is knackered as well. Oh, I mean, it's, it feels like that or nothing to, to, to be honest, doesn't it? The only other players we can buy out wide are Bale and, and Bale. You know, I think. You know, I think. <laughs> Go on, hit me. You know, I don't know whether you're like this. Get Courtney Hawes on for Al Garza. Yeah. Uh, what, on the left wing? No, no, right, do it. Let me just show it. It's easy if you just do it. I mean, I gave you a pause there so you could carry on and you didn't say oh, anything. Oh, sorry. I can't see you, can I? What have we done? Have you done it? I've done it, yeah. Right. Now, put Hawes, in, obviously, in the middle of defence. Yeah. Oh, no. sorry. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to have to go five. We're going five at the back. Yeah. Uh-huh. Brenda, Brenda is a 10. Okay. Yeah, I don't mind that. Yeah, we do, we're doing that. Let's... Mm. I have no idea which one's over right back because that really is a back five, but there was no one else to come and play right. So I'm, I'm happy to defend him for the next 20 minutes. Go to cautious then. So we would be narrow as well. Let's play through the middle instead of because obviously everything is now through the middle. Don't want to play out defence, let's not go for mental. I'm yeah. going to lower the tempo a bit. Oh, yeah. You're learning, you're starting to learn things now. I mean, I know how you to play t- the game. You can tell that you've been studented by me. Studented a word? Probably no. not. Taught is the word you were looking for. Yeah, studented. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, Started yeah, off with the manager on the Commodore 64. No, no, that's, I didn't do that. Never heard of that. 
this is football 02, the only football game when you could dive and two foot, two foot, two foot properly. I remember being able to dive on uh, one of the early Pro Evos, maybe. Yeah, that was good. Though. I don't know why they took that out. Because diving is <laughs> frowned upon. It's part, of, it's part of the game. Yeah. Uh, Courtney Hawes. Um, I've got faith in you. He hasn't played much in his given yeah. conference. To be fair, he's unhappy with his playing time, so I expect him to come nervous. on here he's and al- do something. He's also nervous. I said there. So we've got 20 minutes. As long as we don't massively invite pressure, I think we'll still be okay. Their XG is good, though. It's a long time to say how this is. Tutored, maybe, says Chris. Yeah. Pardon? Tutored, maybe, was the word you were looking uh, for. Yeah. But I'll just say talk. Here we go, McGinn. Go on, McGinn. Goal, just score. See the game. Be fresh. Out. It's not a bad effort. <sighs> I don't know what I'm happy with. The last couple of games. Ramza? Yeah. Ramza's he's pretty on good. Seven, he's on seven here. He's better than that waste of time you bought, Villa. <laughs> It's a squad game. I just feel we're in trouble. A lot of tired legs. If you were both hosting a dinner party and you could invite four people each, eight people to think of, who would you pick and why? Because let's just pick four between us. But does it it have to be Villa related? Yeah, let's keep it football related. Former Villa players, I would say. Former Villa players? Yeah, just to spice it up. I don't know if I'd invite someone that I'd already met. I probably would. You'd have to have tiles there, wouldn't you? You'd have tiles there because he'd be good, good value. Yeah, mentored was the word you were looking for, by the <laughs> I way. Went, I went to the Punjabi Villains event last week with John Gregory, which was excellent, by the way. And uh, for some reason, I, he'd never told me this, but I got into my head that Tiles was coming. So I was telling everyone that Tiles was coming. <laughs> he, he was never coming. So I made him look like he was a, a massive disappointment for like, not coming because I, for some reason, had in my head that he was coming. Oh, I love that. Did you want uh, a drink so before telling everybody that? This was after like a, a sip of beer. No, yeah, fair enough. I just thought he was pl- I thought he was coming. Um, so Tiles is one. Yeah, instant rapport there with one of your first guests. That makes sense, doesn't it, for a dinner party? Yeah, because we know him as well, don't yeah, we? So makes sense. It makes sense. And, and we're at this dinner party, I presume. Yeah, we're obviously there. You and me are there and four others. I'm, and instantly, the name you just suggested, I'd say John Gregory as well, just for the storytelling. I've heard a lot of them before, but great storyteller. Yeah, great group. I kind of want people that I've never, oh. not, not spent, ne- never spent any time with in some ways. Because then I'd, if I invite John Gregory and Tyres, I'd feel bad that I'd not invite Brian. <laughs> we invite Brian as well. It's actually Brian that was birthday today, so many happy birthdays, no. Brian. I wish him happy birthday. Um, but then yeah. we've only got one space for someone, and it, you know. Yeah, then the, the, the other person's going to feel like an outsider, aren't they, when you and me are hanging around with Tyres? No, no, no. Now I'd feel bad that I'd not invited Tony Daler, the nicest yeah. man in football. So he they'd, have to, he'd have to come as well. Yeah, he says I meant celebrities, doesn't have to be just footballs. Yeah, we've got to keep it real related. I don't care about celebrities. But what we've done there, we've probably we've invited the four like <laughs> ex villa people that I know best. <laughs> Somebody I'd like to hear more of that I've not spoken to before is Larson and Melberg. But I don't know how good they would be at a times. dinner party. I mean, we had Larson on the podcast, yeah, but only once. I've got Melberg's number. I've got Never Tyra Minks's number, did you know? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, how old are you? Someone's asked me. I was shocked when you said that Dan Bardell was 36. Is that shocked in a way that you thought he was older? <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. Uh, it's because I come across so young. I'm my... 26 tomorrow. I'm 25 at the moment. It's my birthday tomorrow. It's your oh, birthday tomorrow. Oh, I should oh, know. Oh, I felt oh, like that's something I should know. And I I almost, didn't... Oh, we've won, by the Good way. Good win. Yeah, great Good win. win. Uh, I almost shared a little uh, birthday with Brian Little, which I would have loved. But yeah, 26 tomorrow. I'm expecting people really? to think I'm older for some reason. Uh, yeah, you look old. I don't look old. If you don't look old, I definitely don't look old. Also, when we know that when the Villa View first started and I was comfortably the oldest, you were still the most switched on about sorting things out. Oh yeah. I'm a bit better nowadays. I'm good at sorting things out nowadays, but very, very uh, well done. That was an excellent. That win. is a good win. It's a battling win. I also just want to because Courtney Horse is unhappy with us, so I just want to tell him he was good. I thought you did really well. Congratulations. Yeah, oh, just, just let him know. What are you getting for your birthday? Uh probably nothing. I don't know. I mean, you'll get something. No, 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 no. I haven't got you anything. Spoiler. Well, there's a spoiler. Considering you didn't know it was tomorrow, I'm not surprised you haven't brought me a present. <laughs> Your present was this morning, getting to watch oh, Jonathan right. Wilson, Josh and me do a podcast. I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what I'm happy with as my present is winning games of Football Manager. That's true. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, Look at my this. Look at this. Run a form. Oh, we love to see it. How many goals is that? One, uh, nine, ten, fourteen. Sixteen goals in seven games. We six, are prolific. Six wins out of five in the uh, five, no five wins out of six in the league in a row. That's very good. 
Uh, now we've got this crucial FA third, FA Cup third round replay. We have to rest some players that we have to rest some players. Yeah, but we, I, I want to win that. I do too, but and we will, but we're gonna have to rest some players. McGinn can't play. We're up to twelfth now. I mean, that gap to, to I mean seventh gets you some kind of European football, which I mean the title is the European tour, so I'd accept that. We're only what eight points Six off seventh Chelsea. now. We're, yeah, we're we're chipping away at that. So maybe we don't need to win the FA Cup to get into Europe. Maybe we'll do it on league. I still league think Sunday. we could do. It'd be nice to win something, wouldn't it? Oh, but yeah, we'd all love to see him. It'd be nice to have a nice day out, Wembler. Cage of Press Conference of as keen. He's literally just not prepared to answer any question, which I kind of like. Since, I'm a bit stupid there, but since Keane's come in, the results have been better. What I mean, and who signed Roy Keane as assistant manager? Aston Villa Football Club. Yeah, that's my idea, though, wasn't it? Um, <laughs> you signed Villa, so you know, all gone for you. <laughs> one good, one bad. He's not even bad either. Uh, comes to his quality, handy, says handy. Conrad Gudger. He has to start every game. We just start every game, so good one. Back to the handy dinner party question. <laughs> uh, what would the starter, main, and dessert be? Oh, I don't have the brain. Problem because I'm, I'm I'm vegetarian, so it'd be a problem, wouldn't it? We wouldn't be having vegetarian food if I was in charge. Well, well I wouldn't be able to eat. Then. Well, you'd have to just have something separate on your own. I'll tell you what, I'd have to put some of the Punjabi villains food. Good food. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good Indian oh, was... Indian spread. Would but they had, they had vegetarian stuff as well. Uh, Watkins set to move to West Ham? Absolutely I mean, not. He's not. I mean, he's uh, not either. We've got to have a quick press conference for Gareth Barr, haven't we? I, am, I mean, of... the, the, the world is there to it's say the, It's a Hollywood signing, isn't it? Imagine Perslow yeah. sat at the table next to Gareth Barr. Oh, he'd be absolutely... Oh, my God. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to go with all the best answers because yeah. let's get through this quickly. I'm just doing it for, for the jokes of it. Um, you got to choose something. Best you position, best position, sub, impact sub, <laughs> attacking mid. He's not going to. He's not going to play right though. Is that what Bailey plays? Doesn't matter. Bailey's still on internationals. Um, Bardell is the big Ron manager of the Claret and Blue Channel. Says Rora. Yeah. Is that a compliment? Uh, I'll I take it. So. If it is. Yeah, Ron was a good manager. To be fair. Uh, what does it mean for Bertrand Traore? I want to get the both out of them together. Uh, Gareth is a magnificent capture. Every conference he can write his name into Aston Villa de- legend if in his two years. Gareth Bale is very happy with that press conference, so we'll take that and move on. Melberg's all over uh, football manager, isn't it? Yeah, don't know why. Oh, I mean, I've got Bale. Larson in as a coach. I always get Larson in as a coach. No, I think I did look at him the early doors, and I don't think he I was gave him in the youth, the youth academy, defensive uh, coach. God. He's not in the game in my database, so. That's I mean, the, that. it's a shocker that the two players I wanted to sign are not <laughs> even in your game. Yes, yeah, I'm trying to set up a quick database so we can get through it properly, not sit here for hours on end, just it's loading the game. Um, Bale is still only 32. Wow, yeah, exactly. We've, we've got us young around the squad at 36, so... Gareth Bale's like, oh, Flick's been sacked by Newcastle. I told you that about five minutes ago. You I did you? Me. Oh, I didn't yeah. hear uh, Cavani's gone to Arsenal, which is mm-hmm. interesting. Uh, anything else going yeah, on? Oh, obviously, this is the first transfer window that anyone can make any signings. So I'm oh, could no, can no something. one then? Yeah, can no just one do the that. transfer window shut as a whole. 26 million, 30 year old. So I'm interested to see what people do. Uh, Newcastle are trying to do everything. But we don't need all this here, do we? Let's give them a day off or let's rest somewhere. They will go out in the evening still, though. Yeah. yeah bit team bonding. Bit really team bonding after Christmas. Um. Did you listen to Perslow on TalkSport today? He spoke very well. I, I didn't, I bits. I've seen bits, yeah. I've seen that a lot. <laughs> seen it on match of the day. Um, yeah. I think Brentford, Brentford play far at the back. They are fifth in the Premier League, so this absolutely won't be easy. And then we've got Everton in the league. After that, we were 15th, and I was, again, I want to win that. I always take Brentford's director of football in, football <clears> manager, <throat> not, where, wherever I am, I always get Giles. Maybe we should get him. Sat too far further forward, by the way. No, I'm alright. I've even looked at one. <clears throat> um, yeah, you look fine. I just wondered that I might be cut off the screen because I'm leaning so further forward. Um, right, got a couple of days still. Team bonding. I wonder what that team bonding is. If you were manager and you had to sort things like team bonding, where would you take the squad? It's a tough question, though. Is it? <laughs> We said bowling last time, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, I was going to say, I think we mentioned bowling before. I only say bowling because the last time I went bowling, I had a world from absolutely nowhere, which never happened. Oh, no, I'm not very good at bowling. Uh, I wouldn't choose bowling, though. Not paint bowling. I, I think just a, not, a nice meal somewhere as, as a group would be good. 
rather I'm than an active way too seriously this question. Yeah, I mean, you said tough question. I think it's not really. No, you know, it's a bit of a nothing question. I'm gonna pick something good. Two point three million for Feeney now. Reject all these offers as well. I can't reject all. I don't know why. Um, Leon might loan approach for Algarve. Not worth it, is it for loan? But he actually he might want to go there. He scored in the last game. Uh, Gilbert. Hard contract. An offer. Uh, Mings in the team of the week, which is nice. The usual standard. Uh, add free kick taker Gareth Bale. Absolutely. Where is he? I mean, you could have just uh, let the computer do that for you then. But yeah, you know, I don't know how. It literally was a button. You just had to press one button. And it was oh, I, I didn't see it. We don't I want did. Attack I pressed that. I pressed apply. Oh, we oh, okay, we don't want to attack in corners. Why not? We want him in the box. He's good headers. Is he? Yeah. He's got 16 for heading. Is he actually? So, yeah. Fair enough. Jumping range 15, 6 foot 1. Um, As to our set pace, prowess. How do I undo that? <laughs> set pace takers. Get rid of that. Can we just look at the corners very quickly as well and see where he is on the attacking ones? Because we've got Mings attacking the near post and Ollie Watkins attacking the far post. Buendia Merck in the middle. We don't want that, do we? Buendia is marking the keeper. Literally the most pointless person <laughs> in the game to mark the keeper. <laughs> uh, we don't even know where Bow's playing yet. Yeah, I know. But it will, it'll be the midfielder, won't it? Oh, God, we'll work out. Let's the do the team for the when we do the team for the next game. We'll work on that. We'll see what's yeah, you, you have to change it on a game by game anyway. Oh, no, but no, we haven't, no one's got time for that though. Have they? Oh, I've got time. Studi Bakers for team bonding says David. Team night out at Snobs. Yeah. Back, I bet that's where they used to. I went to Snobs not that long ago. I bet you were the oldest man as there. I was telling, as I was telling, I told, we had, I told this story literally on another WhatsApp group that we're in. Uh, I know, yeah, but it's not for the I'm stream. Not gonna it? It. I'm not going to repeat it on air, but I, <laughs> yes, I was the oldest there. <laughs> Um, when is the Inner City oh. Academy being built? Uh, I think they're... I don't is know. In, is the football manager question or a real no, life question? a real life question. I think uh, it's on the way, I think is the, the word. Uh, Take them to the Tamworth, Tamworth Snowdrome. Star City no, for mini golf. Yeah, good shout. Love a bit of I mini don't golf. like a bit of mini golf, to be honest. Yeah, I've not been mini golf a long time. What's the Louise injury? That could be bad news. The so away. After two weeks. It's not what we need at the moment. Uh, seven, ten days with a doctor. Well, no, well, uh, we play through injury. It's only a facial laceration. Oh, yeah. Fair enough. Someone studied him in the face, haven't they? Oh, oh. oh in this room. A random, I'm freezing. I've just shivered. Uh, a random one, but the best autograph I've ever had was from Doug Ellis at Swansea Away. It wasn't just a scribble, as he signed his name really well. What's the best autograph you boys have ever had? I remember getting an autograph from somebody who stood behind the, the fancy bit in the Trinity where I'm sat. I think it was one of the England managers. It might have been Capello. Wow. When he came to watch, when I'd have been, I don't know, whenever however old I was when he was England manager. I think I got him to sign a program. I'm like, I don't know where that is now. Not really ever been an autograph do. hunter. When I went to Disney World, you get all the characters' autographs when I was a kid. And I really wanted Donald Duck's autograph. I remember being buzzing to get Donald Duck's autograph. <laughs> Christ, I don't think that's what they meant by the question, but fair enough. I've got quite a lot of signed shirts. Um, by the way, our scouts have said only sign Aaron Hickey as a last resort. Yeah, we don't want him. Which is surprising. I've got a signed Holland Ron Blar shirt, literally by my legs. Yeah, that's and a signed Ben Teco Belgium shirt. Um, I'm just going to reject that because I don't want to look into it. I don't know what the best autograph is. I used to want autographs as a kid, but nowadays you have photos, don't you? Like mm, selfies. Oh, Stephen than... Gerrard is Wolf manager. There you go. He looks very pleased with himself. Wow. I love seeing stuff like that. That's interesting. I wonder who will end up at Rangers. I wonder has Dean Smith got another job yet, by the way? He was obviously sacked when we started this. Removed from the role. Still was unemployed. Sacking that was. That's a surprise that he's still unemployed. He'll pick up a job. Left manager 21. Yeah, that's weird. Okay, continue. Who would you rather have as Villa manager? Dumbledore or Gandalf? I've never watched the Harry Potters and I've not really watched the Lord of the Rings. Wow. Either, so You've never watched Harry Potter? Device. Based on the Ricky Gervais programme Extras, I'll have Dumbledore. No, Dumbledore's Harry Potter, isn't it? <laughs> <Is> it Gandalf. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I'd get that the wrong way around. Well, I've never seen Lord of the Rings, so I'd pick Dumbledore. Harry Potter is an elite set of films. Do you not um, want like? A, did, would you not have Ian McClellan for that extra scene? Um, that is a good scene. 
But no, because that's not the question. It's the character. Know, I'd rather um, have Dumbledore. I went to see Harry Potter. Well, this is years ago with my girlfriend at the time. I'd never seen any of them. And it was the third one. He'd... Oh, I love the and third one. And the film started and they were talking about muggles and I asked her what a muggle was. And honestly, man, the people that heard, it was like, it was the worst <laughs> thing you could ever say <laughs> in the world. I felt like people wanted to kill me because I didn't know what a muggle was. Oh, that's good. I love that. Uh, we need some rotation here. There's... Yeah, we're not playing the full strength, but this is a this is a genuine route into Europe. So Ings is playing instead of Watkins. Yeah, I don't mind that. I don't Can't have to play him. Douglas Louise here either, to be honest. I know we haven't got anyone else to play in that position, have we? Target can come back in. He's missed a few games. He's fit now. He only missed one game. Bailey's back. Oh hello, Leon. Bailey, his fitness is rubbish all oh, the time. Bloody hell, Leon. Come on the no, bench. That's been off. For Twan's AB. Oh, Twan's AB. I saw that in a sec, because they're going to be end up playing, aren't they? I know, yeah. Um, Bandier's fitness is always rubbish as well. We don't really have anyone, though. It's, it's Bale or Bailey. Well, Bale has lacked sharpness. Yeah. Get Bale starting. We've signed him. We've not even played him. Gareth Bale starts. Don't care what you say. He wants to play as a... I can't That's even say the word. Trek Artista. He's not, a winger. He's, not, he's not a winger. He's an inside forward. Well, his favourite role is inverted winger, but fine. But he's not. He's an inside forward. Attack. Matty Cash can't attack with Gareth Bale on that side. Um, I'm tempted not even to play him. I'm going to put Young at we right haven't got back. Okay, fine. Uh, Cons from Mings as well. Get Twan's Ivy in there. I don't want to take Mings out. Really? Okay. Uh, his, his fitness looks okay. Yeah, I know, can say. Give Cons a give Cons for a rest. Where's what's Twan's Ivy not playing? What's Twan's Ivy not playing? Twan's Ivy might have to play defensive mid, to be fair. Yeah, I don't mind that. Don't mind yeah. that at all. Okay. But play him as a half back. Yeah, half back. Um, Villar can stay. I want to swap Ramsey for Chuck Maker though. No, oh, no, no. Give Ramsey's Ramsey's buzzing. Really? Okay. Yeah, Ramsey's playing well. Is Bailey playing in the youth games? I don't think so. He's just been away he's with, a... with, with um, Jamaica and yeah, he's, probably, yeah. he's probably played a game not long ago and that's why he's not fit. Leave Watkins on the bench. His fitness has always been an issue. Uh, El Gar is on the left. On the Can we get rid of him as well? Don't really have no, anyone there, do we? He hasn't played loads of games. Yeah. Yeah, fitness is alright. I'm not sure about the bench we've got going on here. Why? You're only allowed seven subs because we're playing a I know we should be allowed nine. Have we got nine? Yeah, yeah but they're grayed no. out here, so does that mean they're not? No, no, are they? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we've only got seven subs in the FA Cup. Um, we'll, we'll probably need cash more than we'll need... I can't take Brenda here off the bench. Sure, Maker. Well, I'll Brenda here, okay. No, it's like Bailey. Bailey's injured, it's pointless. Okay. I don't have any other options anyway, so that's it. Doug's so easy, and we might as well just carry on resting yeah, on there. Yeah. And then the rest are all injured anyway. Okay, uh, I think again, keep all the instructions the same. We're away. Yeah. Yeah, fine. Submit. Hope Gareth Bale's lacking the match, which doesn't matter. Yeah, we've got two uh, substitutes outside the 11. It's fine, it's a matter of Yeah. Okay. I'll be there next time. Uh, oh, they're asking whether he plays youth camps to get him up to fitness. Uh, uh, well, we'd play him in the yeah. 23s, wouldn't we? But he's been a while. Bailey goes on international duty for the FA Cup final. <laughs> Well, let's deal with that if we get to the cup final. I'm sure that won't happen. <clears throat> my headphones hurt my ears. Um, it looks like they've rested a few, but I'm not having really. Well, they've maybe rested a few. Tony's playing, Rico Henry. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's not, we should be able to beat these, I think. There's some goalkeepers playing, which is good. I don't like that top one straight away. That's asking for trouble, I think. Um, Let's don't allow a good run of forms to come to an end, keep it going. Yeah, that's better. Okay. Give Hall some love again. Okay. We're really getting on well. I feel like we're trying, we're rebuilding the relationship with Courtney Horse that Pat and oh. James ruined. Oh, Danny Ings as well, expecting to show up and perform. So is his chance. Say. Ings needs to do something. You should tick the unavailable filter to hide all those you can't use. I did do that last time and Dan had a yeah, go for it. Because it, there was something stupid happened because of it. It's very zoomed out. All right, then here we go in the white away kit. I love the white away I kit. Do. I think it's my favourite this year. Uh, yeah. I'm not a massive fan of that third kit. Yeah, probably the away. The we, won Old Traf- we won at Old Trafford in it as well, so go down in folklore because we won't win there again for the <laughs> Okay, here we go. First highlight. 
weak owner is getting a lot of free crosses in. We should always look to trigger a press when the ball is gone. I mean, he's going to be getting some spies because he's up against Bale. <laughs> I forgot Gareth Bale was playing. That's the mental, oldest, isn't it? the oldest right hand side you'll ever see, Bale and Ashley Young. <laughs> oh yeah, oh, ah, yeah. probably shouldn't have played Young. I forgot all about that. I let you do it on me as well. I didn't pick up on it. But you know, if there's a bit, of, yeah, like, I might be wrong. Just uh, looking for some bow magic. If there's a bit of bow magic that gets us through to the next round, that's an inspired signing, isn't it? Like, Gareth Bale's available for how much we paid for him. One mil. You have to do, it, don't you? Got the bit of you, like I'm worried that I'm gonna. Like, I think Bale plays if it's stupid when I don't do it. I've got podcast fatigue today. I've already done. It's my third one of the day. We were talking about uh, Samson in our, on one of our last ones and saying about him getting back on the training pitch. Now in my head, I'm thinking he's injured for eight months because he's injured on this. <laughs> And then made myself look stupid. Um, I don't want to press him though, because I don't want Ashley Young to be out of position every time Rico Henry comes forward. I'd rather he just did his should job defensively. Should we plug Edge of the Box podcast? Uh, you can if you want. I want you to do it. Well, I don't want to do it. It's your stream. Yeah, but I'll, I'll you allow you it. to do it as the host. You work as the, for as the guest, sorry. Uh, yeah, right. people probably don't know that you produce it. No, that's you true. You don't shout about it, so... Me and Rollo, in, oh God, me and Rollo do the Who Scored podcast, the weekly Premier League preview show. Is, oh, I think it's really it's good. good fun. I think it's good. That. You love what you do. You like produced it because you actually enjoy watching it, don't you? Yeah, like I'm, it's it's one of those old fashioned ones where I'm like, my work on that is I'm watching it as the audience would watch it. So I'll watch yeah. along and edit it as we go through, and then post it. And yeah, it's good. But you won't you won't believe it, but me and Rollo sometimes work with professionals. <laughs> you know, we work with Jonathan Wilson, and he is. He's one of the, to be fair, he's one of the goats of yeah. journalism, isn't he, really? I remember thinking he, he would be a bit uptight maybe when we started, yeah, a bit like, maybe a bit too serious, but like when we're, when we're off air, he's nothing like that, and even when we're on air, he's obviously very serious, yeah, he and he's it. a serious journalist, which is unlike anything I've ever done, <laughs> but even, you know, he's willing to have a joke, and he's very funny as well, which I, I didn't quite expect him to be. Which yeah. says so never, check out Edge of the Box podcast. Never judge a book by its cover. Martin Lawrence is all right as well. Yeah. When he's on. Yeah, he's people who've watched that podcast will know Martin Lawrence. We've had him on a couple of times. Yeah. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, guys, on the left side. Let's get a goal because I'm nervous. You cannot explain centre back for them. Oh, Trent Zabi, that's not what we've put you in for. Mings, has, Mings has done well there. Mings is on, on good defensive form as yeah, well as yeah. his goal score. Yeah, he sweeps up well for us. Something we is happening here. He needs to get involved. There was a nice bit of link up there. Yeah. Ings involved, dropping a little bit deep. Villar still keeps it alive. Target back to Villar. Can't do something. Ramsey yeah, into the, the area. Oh, oh Ramsey. Not bad. not bad. Since you bought Villar, Ramsey's been better than him. Yeah, he's developing off him. That's why he's learning off a good player. He's not learning off him at all. He's 23. There's not much difference in age between. <laughs> Come on. Break counter. I thought oh. on Saturday in real life, at the start of the game, first 10 minutes, Ings was. Obviously, Bland as a striker, he started to drop deep and link up, and I thought, yes, this is going to be good. Mm. And then we didn't really link up again. Yeah, but we will. I don't know he's too good a player for him not to work. Yeah. He's, he's, he's a goal scorer. If you give him chances in and around the box, he'll score. Go on. I wish he'd score more in the game, though. Yeah, football manager, though, he doesn't want to know. But look, at, I mean, he should, shouldn't be having to do what he's yeah. doing there, dribbling. He's offside. Offside. Lucky Bale. Good position, though. <laughs> yeah. Villar can spray, spray the passes when the people are offside the lights and that. Villar's fault for playing the ball. All right, half time then. Still no no with Brentford. Just can't break them down over two games now, or game and a half. So, I, mean, they, I mean, they did contend three in real life against Newcastle, but generally they're quite organised. Mm. Ings low, lowest rating for us is Ashley Young, 6.5. <laughs> Okay. And we've got Watkins who is in red hot form on the bench to come off and change things. I think we leave it for now. So yeah, and just tell them you can. You've been alright, but do better if that's an option. I'm already starting to think about penalties and penalty takers. Uh, Although I don't know whether we've got any penalty takers on that bench. No, Watkins is probably the only one worth bringing off for that. Watkins will come on at some point anyway. I'm starving, by the way. Me too. I can smell something. There's definitely something in the oven downstairs. Oh, God. Hopefully it's from there. How are playing a five at the back? Yes, 
difficult place to go, the community stadium, if that's yeah. what it's called. Is that what it's called? I haven't heard yeah, that. I think so. It's called. Well, on a few fitness issues, and it's not Gareth Bale, surprisingly. It's Tyron Mings. I mean, we might as well give Bale the no answer. Tyron Mings, he's, we don't need that. Canos is getting a lot of free crosses in. Let's press him. I can't work out where Canos is playing. He's playing right wing, but he seems to be all over the place. Mm. But I'll tell you, he's going to score. Good save. No, I'm not saying this is good, isn't it? Let's I make a stop. Except that I, so we probably didn't accept that 80 million. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I was just tempted to do it because 80 million would we could have gone and done something really not great. Ings at 10, Watkins up front, Twanzabi off. No, not Twanzabi off. What do we, what do we need? A you know, he's coming out of the midfield. Mid, it can't be a lot of players. What's his penalty taking? Seven. Seven. Please. <laughs> He's got all bases covered for us, hasn't he? What's Brendaya's penalty? We need to start looking at penalty takers, Brendaya. Nine. No. Jesus. I mean, Watkins is Indian. definitely coming on. He's putting the guys at 11. I mean, that's probably a good score for us, generally. McGinn, 10. Maybe get the big boys on McGinn and Watkins. McGinn yeah. for Villar. Yeah, off he comes, useless. <laughs> Strike shot for Ings. Oh, I don't know. I feel like Ings deserves a bit more time. No, we're leaving Ings on because if it goes to penalties, but then we've got Algarzi, Bale, Mink, and Ings for penalties. They're, they're all good at penalties. No, not Twins either. I'm, ch- I'm, I'm taking things into my own hands here. We don't need a DM against Brentford away. They're all over us. I, I know. I just I don't need it. Let's make Ramsey be a bit more careful. But that isn't what he's about. I know, but we've got all these on attack. Put McGinn as a day long line maker, then he's not boxed, not going boss to boxing at all. Defence, sit back. I'll just put him defend Ramsey back to support. Mm, okay. We just need to I'll do allow. that. I want to go. Allow that. Oh, better passing as well. Get rid of that. Let's just launch it. You just said something strange there. What do you mean you're going better passing? What does that mean? Uh, more direct is what I meant. Okay, fine. <laughs> Longer for some passing. You, for some reason you think direct is better. I was confused by. Okay, right. It's, yeah, it's too defensive. It's not. We're, we're tired. We're, yeah, but I'd like yeah, you're playing a centre back in DM. Like that is defensive. There was no one else to play. Yeah, there was literally no one else to don't play. Don't play a there. DM. There we go. Ashley Young with a free kick. Oh, that wasn't far. Was Bale not taking that? Going to the set pieces menu, it tells all the penalty stats of each. Yeah, that would have been a lot quicker. Yeah, I know. Ings, Ings, uh, El Ghazi, and Bale. That'll be the pen takers. I'm sure I'm not going to so... oh, we're going to this. That's where it's going. I would take penalties, though, to be honest. And if we go out of the FA Cup, we absolutely have to finish in Europe somehow. We can't I mean, We can't have a football manager title called the European Tour and not get I mean, I've got to say, obviously I wasn't involved. Oh, no. oh, damn. oh he's, he's offside. Is he? Oh, good. Yeah. Okay. Obviously, I wasn't involved in the titling of this series, but I wouldn't have called it that. Yeah, but I just thought we'd fly straight through the first season and get straight to Europe. I didn't think it would be what, this you, difficult. Uh, you, say, you say you're someone that's played football manager before. What made you think with Villa that that was going to happen? Because this this squad on a game where it's not like real life could get into Europe. Danny's a 6.3. He should have come off. No, no, but penalties don't take him off. 13 for penalties. That's better than what we have. You need the penalty options. Oh God, he's 17 for penalties. Yeah. What's Bales? Is Ashley Ash, Young or on penalties? Uh, he missed a penalty in the Carabao Cup on this. Yeah, but he's, he's 12. He's 12, he's decent. We don't want to take him off then. Um, Cash for target, maybe. Oh, Ashley was knackered is the Cash, only problem. Cash Means he's back. knackered. Because uh, now you've took time to be off. We can't even move him back into the... Oh, I mean, Conser, I'll get Conser on for Mings and swap him and Hawes around. Horns is a ball playing defender? No, no, get up. him as a central defender. We're not going to be playing out from the back at the moment. Okay, you put conscious of the ball playing one, actually. I reckon with Ashley Young being tired, you want him on the cover as well. Have him as the cover rather than he's quick. Okay. He'll drop off for us. If Ashley Young does get exploited. There we go. Just score, please. Okay, what's taken the throw in? God, that's poor. Away. But why is he taking the time? I don't know. Oh, he's actually young about to get exploited. Oh, he's seen him wide. Well, I don't know, oh. oh, my word. Good stuff. That's some of the most... Oh, no, that's some of the Second ball, ball though. Oh, yes, Villa. No, Villa. That from Ashley Young there. You know, what, a, what a lesson for the younger players watching that <laughs> desire and heart to keep himself going. We're going to concede. 
Oh, they're God, not. Well done, Courtney Hawes. Get rid. So you've got okay. players here that Good. want they want to get in the team. They're fighting to get in the team, fighting for their lives. Hawes, he's suddenly having a taste of it and he wants more. Do we go positive here? No, because I think we're struggling. Okay. I think we're happy with penalties because we've got good pen takers. We've made sure we've got the pen takers on the pitch. Okay. I'd even say at this point, just shut up, shut up. I can, I'll drop down to cautious. Well, I mean, we definitely, absolutely don't want to lose from this position, but I'm exactly. half tempted to have gone attacking to maybe Nick a light winner. That's, that's an amateur hour from you thinking that. Mm, not if it works. <laughs> There's a small chance of it working. <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. That's a good time. What am I saying? Mate, sit right. Go in tactics, please. Okay. From a corner, yeah. though? Yeah, it's fine. That's not real life. Oh, it's as good as real life. Were, oh, I thought the fullbacks were pushing up and they're not. It's bail tired, he must be. We can't make any more subs. We've done through. No, no, I'm just looking. Okay, leave it. So if one says go, go all out attack, you've got nothing to lose. We have, because we've... Oh, Phil, it's nil-nil, Phil. Drop back. Trigger the press more, less often? Yes, less often. Sit off them a little bit? Less often, not standard, less often. Oh, less often, okay. Yeah. Um, I don't really want to do this either. Let's hold the ball if we've got it. This whole shape of possession's won as well now. We don't want to be caught out. This is very Alex McLeish, but... I mean, where was this when we were turning up against Liverpool as well, also? <laughs> This is the cup. There's no margin for error. We haven't won the cup since 1957. We want a bit of those. Oh, target off the line. Go on, Watkins. Here we go. Get now up your hand and score. Play it off. Oh, I should have played that through the bail then. Holly Watkins. Greedy. Oh, against his old team trying to do too much. Yeah, I mean, he's in good form, yeah. to be fair. That's well, I was saying real, in real life when he was running towards the whole end on Saturday, I was screaming through to pass the bail. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely screaming, and then he lashed it home. And I El, El Garza, you mean? No, no, I wanted to be back to Baylor. Oh. But I could see from my vantage point in the hole. Three minutes to go, yeah. A minute or two. El Ghazi's run was a dummy run. That was a dummy run. Don't, I don't even way. remember where Bailey was. Bailey was across on the right hand side. Oh, that would be a good time God. for you to score. Why are we taking these risks, Ezra? Oh, I know what we can do. Let's um, tell them to focus. For the last two minutes, yeah. especially from this corner, if it is one, let's go kick. Okay, penalties it is. Oh, it's extra time. Oh, extra time. Are you keeping oh. it? We've got an extra sub. We've got an extra sub. Have we? Yeah, you get an extra sub and extra time. Oh, okay. All right. Um, so we're making some dinner in the background of yours, isn't it? Like I wish it was. Some cutlery going. Someone's doing something. Uh, Someone's making some food in my house. It smells delicious. Keep working hard and you'll be rewarded. Don't let the effort be for nothing. Yeah, I loved it. Let's, um, look this, let's look at the extra sub. Are you sure we get an extra sub? Positive. Okay. Um, I don't think any of the pen I thought that's the problem. Yeah, I mean, Brendy is the second best pen on the bench, so I'll be tempted to get him on, but there's no one to come on for him. I'm not getting Brendy around. It's not necessary. I suppose we might... Hang on. One, two, three, four. I think Ashley Young's in the five, so... Yeah. Cash for target, he's target tired. Mm, yeah. No, I mean, Young is the one who's struggling out of the two. I know, but you need him on for his experience. Look at that recovery run when he was tired that we saw. Yeah, yeah true. Right. Right, cash on the left then, which is no. mental. Uh, no, no, no. 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 Do yeah. that. Yeah, but now we want whores on the cover. Yeah. Comes to normal. And not wing cash back. attack. Cash wing back support. Concert not concert not on the cover. Okay. Alright. As, as if people are watching like these are kind of micro management decisions. <laughs> like people actually tuned in to watch me. There was, there was a ask comment on the last one saying that's for was, a defender to be taken off cover. Somebody said it was better without you because there wasn't as much micro management. But that, that's that's what this game is to an extent. If you're not micro managing, you lose every game like we were in the first few weeks. When he went to Villa Park at the weekend, was he upset that Stephen Gerrard made substitution? <laughs> You've got to find the fine line between entertainment. And taking Believe it me, I am. Um, I am toned down in what I would be like. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'd, I'd, trust me, I know that. 
I already don't like that. Like my reputation is associated with some of these decisions and some of the bad things that happened. <laughs> if I'd have been in from the start, you'd be higher in the league. That's a fact because you've been so much better since I got involved. Yeah. It's an awful goal kick. Bale's done nothing, has he? I don't no, know. Fit, I've not even really seen him doing El Ghazi is dead. Like I'm concerned that they we've got these good penalty takers, but they're not fit enough to take them. No, but they'll get. They only need to walk up and take a penalty. Yeah, I know, but they. they I, think gonna, I, think I think we're going to win. I think we're going to. I think we're going to score. Bale through to Watkins. Oh, what happened? The chance. I thought it was a shot at first. Bale threw it through to Watkins, and he was dispossessed. Uh, all right, half time of extra time. Yeah, not, just go. brilliantly. Let's even, just go straight in. You, yeah. don't even, you don't even get a team talk. I don't no, think. just straight back. You, you get a team talk before pens, don't you? I don't know. Uh, we've got two comments saying that Bardell is the new Steve Bruce, and he's got Steve Bruce post on his wall, and that Bardell ball is looking very similar to Bruce ball at the moment. I think that's outrageous. Who said that? Uh, Brad and none of your business. What? Oh, he's actually. Oh, he's <laughs> calling none of my name, business. Yeah. Not, you're not just telling me it's none of my business. Correct. They're watching at the end of the day. <laughs> I'm, employed, I'm employed to win football matches. I'm not employed to appease YouTube. Oh, that's I'm a fair response. I'm, I'm happy with that. The dog's on the roof. For my coaching staff. If you said that in a press conference, I'd be happy with that. I mean, I'll start talking like Steve Bruce. Although if you said, I'm here to win football man- matches, I'm not here to appease the fans. I don't think that'd go down very well. No, but that's the kind of thing Steve Bruce would say if he was getting a bit of stick. Yeah, good point. When the record speaks for itself, doesn't it? We, we've well, won we've five lost, out of six games in the league. And we've only lost three since I've been on board, and one of them was against Chelsea. We've taken yeah. a point off Manchester United, a point off Liverpool. What do people want from that? Oh, oh God. No, they don't want, they don't want that. <laughs> oh, it was an unfortunate timing. I was going to say, yeah. Terrible timing. That will probably go on Twitter. Um, uh, I mean, what can we do about that? That was very Mark Goldbridge, that was. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, close him down. I mean, it's a rasper. We have to go. We'll go for it, mate. Yeah, we don't have a choice, do we? You have to press that button. That I don't like to press. All out attack. Very attacking. No, we're going very attacking. It's the FA Cup. Mm. Doesn't matter if we lose three 0 does it? Yeah, I suppose. Um. Yeah, box to box. No box to box. Um, Tempo is extremely high. I don't remember pressing that. It's because we've just gone very attacking. Uh, fair enough. Okay, be more disciplined. Uh, tag off, be more disciplined. Um, don't need either of these either. Counter. When position has been one counter. Yeah, we're going to press now. We'll regroup though. Distribute. No, no, we won't. Why? Can't press as well. We'll regroup. We're losing. Yeah, we're losing. Okay. All right. Distribute quickly. Tag yeah. long kicks. Tag long kicks. We're going to distribute it out over the opposition defence to Watkins at this point. Yeah. Yeah. It's a disastrous goal. I would usually put a centre back up front at this point as well, but I don't really want to do that. Alright. Uh, it's only ever worked for me once in football <laughs> history. Uh, I, mean, I can even tell you the player that scored for me. It, was, it worked so little. Robert Huth. <laughs> well, we have got a highlight here. Six minutes to go. Bale win headers at the very oh, least. The Brentford one there. Ramsey, come on. It's here we go. Jack Ramsey's been imperious. Bale, it's a good ball for Watkins, but he's I think offside. he's offside. He's put it wide anyway. He's bloody missed anyway. <sighs> get Corny Hawes up front. Another highlight. Corny Hawes up front, really? He's tall. We'll get the ball in the box. Oh, God. Mate, he's the FA Cup. We're losing. Don't like this. It's a bit of fun. We saw him Gareth Bale for a laugh. We can get Gordon Hill in for <laughs> yeah, fair. Target man. Support. No attack. Get in the box. <sighs> yeah, one centre back's all that's required. <laughs> Ridiculous. <laughs> Mate, we're losing in I the know, FA Cup. Know, we, wanted to, we wanted to win this. We gave you the big talk. Do you think we did too much rotation? I don't know. We didn't do anything drastic. Well, the system's still that. the same, isn't it? We're still playing the same way. We didn't take... I think fitness. It's a busy time yeah. of year, isn't it? And the players aren't fit and we don't have enough rotation to make the changes. Right, look, that... This is where you say, 
in the modern game, should we be playing FA Cup replays? Yeah, great point. Oh, cunt. <laughs> Well, I didn't actually know it was going to go for replay. We thought it was going to go to penalties an extra time last episode. I think it's the latter rounds they do that in the FA Cup. Mm. I could be wrong. One minute of extra time. Ooh, it was a highlight, though. It's not us. Yeah, we were looking to dispossess and win it back counter. You're very dream. You're dream world. Well, you? if you don't dream, what's the point? Cool, now you get up front. You're not a defender now. I'm dying for a wee, by the way. Are we going to do another one, or is this the end? I think it's the end because I can smell food and I'm really hungry. Okay, fair enough. And if we lose, I need to recover from going out of the FA Cup. I didn't want that on my watch. Uh, yeah, I know. We've done, done well in the league. I'm tempted to carry on and play another because it's Everton. But maybe let's be conservative. Win it. Oh, come on. Mm, it's over. I think the dream's over. Still going to be Aston Villa hasn't won the FA Cup since 1957. Or... For another year. Go on, Bale. Do something, for God's sake. Last kicks of the game. Twenty thousand pound a week. Got to be something special. He's been dispossessed by him. Where I need Chris Samber up top. Oh, effectively got that. Cash. Oh, come cash on, put the ball in. Fresh. Do something. Horse. Ball imagine in. Horse scored. Horse. Oh, <laughs> that would be so good. Can you imagine if that had happened? <laughs> Young I'd have gone man, down come in, on. Fo- I'd have gone down in folklore if Courtney Horse had scored. Go on, oh God, he left corner. side ball in. Ah, oh, Watkins oh, can't win the temp- ball. Where was his tempo earlier? Oh, there we go. Final whistle in the FA Cup. Defeat to Brentford over two legs, 1-0. It's our first defeat for six or seven games. We weren't good. They were 22 shots. We weren't good enough. I don't have the words to express how angry that makes me. No. <laughs> I'm not happy with the result. <laughs> oh, I'm proud of your efforts. It just wasn't to be. It just deserve, wasn't to be. Deserved no, to move, says no. Phil. Too defensive. Go away, oh, Phil. Um, we huffed and we puffed. Where's They're that? tired. Where's that? What? That's not an option. We huffed and we puffed. Yeah, we have. Yeah, we put that in. Uh, I know, I'm just talking. That's just a phrase. I'm just saying. We just didn't have enough to get through extra time. Yeah, I can sympathise. They've been on a great run. Yeah. Been cracking, lads. I mean, if we can still get into York through the through the league, so... Ah, wake up, brother. No, you got a dream. Um, Holly says, lads, I I'll did. watch this back, but can I request you do a stream on Monday, Tuesday or Wednesday? So it definitely won't be on the weekend. The next one will be next week at some point, but I don't know what day. <laughs> Um, Ings, you've been vowing to end that goal drought for a long I time now. I know. Bale makes debut. That's still funny, isn't it? Um, I'd find Ings half a week's wages for that performance. What was his? What was his rating at the end of that? You said that. You can't find players with bad performances. I mean, you definitely can. Johnny and Lescott would have never got paid. Oh yeah, rightly so. We're getting still tired. <sighs> yeah. Is Dean Smith raising the concern. No, it's the physio, Alan. We uh, had this conversation last time. Selling okay. says Rob. Oh, I'm going to criticise him. I'm not going to. I'm not going to fight yeah, him. Criticise foot. No, put your arm around him, right? Let's just say, I need you to be better. Mm. Up. Don't worry about your goal drought. Oh, I am worried. Oh, yeah. I need you to play better if you want to stay in the first yeah. team. I want you to be want to be clear with you about this. Yeah, fair enough. I mean, what he's is a sensible. He, he's a sensible lad. He knows. He'll know himself. He's finishing eighteen. We just. He's not. I mean, it's too fair. He's right in seven, six point five, six point five, six point four. He's got everything four. you would want. He's got everything you would want. He's his strengths fourteen. He can hold up the ball. He got seven against Spurs in the four 0 win, but didn't score or assist. One goal in nineteen appearances is rubbish, isn't his it? Average, <laughs> his average rating is a yeah. disgrace. It was below average, isn't it? Six point five. In the game, I know fine players for a six. They gain determination and work rate. Apparently. You can't you can't be doing that. Yeah, I wouldn't. I mean criticising is enough for now. I've put Ings in as a poacher and he scored two hat tricks in a row. I mean Ings is scoring the goal, so that's something at least. But if you're playing them both, you've got Ings to Ings has got an assist at least. We're um, this last game. Do you want to play it? It's up to you. I'm pretty hungry. It's up to I'm you. We've been going two well. we've been we've been going two hours. Have we have we actually? Yeah. Okay. All right. I mean, I'm a little bit disappointed because I do want to play, but I mean, let's say it for the next game because if we do play at the next game that we start with, it'll be Man City, and I'd at least want to start next episode off with something better than Man City. If we only play three games, we usually play four, don't yeah, we? Play three. Anything. It's January, though, isn't it? Take, like we said this in the last one, whether we want it, whether people wanted to see it live, whether we do highlights because it does take a while to get through January, but. That's more work for you. You won't be doing that. Absolutely yeah. No chance for it. Yeah, I did realise after it'd be more work and it wasn't really worth it. No one wanted that anyway. They said we want to see every game and everything, so. Yeah, I mean, we're three days away, so it's going to be at least another 10 minutes before we even start the Everton game. 
Yeah, I could do some food, to be honest. So next next time, it'll be next week, Monday, Tuesday or Wednesday, probably Tuesday, I would have thought, whoever's available. Everton, Man City, Palace, potentially Tottenham again, because we have beaten, but it depends how, how fast we get through. We'll end January as well. Uh, that Man City game is going to be pretty grim, though, I would have thought. Uh, quick look at the league table before we go. Form is good. Uh, nine goals for Watkins now, which is much more like it. Nine goals in 22. Yeah, not bad. Uh, 12th place, 27 points from 22 games. Goal difference minus one. Leicester in 7th on 35. West Ham in 6th on 36. Brentford on 5th, by the way, 39 points. Yeah, we've just lost the turn. It's 5th in the league now, yeah. when everyone's knackered. Yeah, that's, I, mean, that's, I mean, it's not great. Well, we've got but... a, show, a show pony playing right before. There's a few people saying play the next game, but no, I'm determined to finish it. I mean, it's, what's, two in it for, what's in it for us? That's the, that's the question I ask. Yeah. Cristiano Ronaldo's got 19 goals in 22 games in the league. That's ridiculous. Mm. That is ridiculous. All right, let me come back and see you. Hang on. All right, we'll call it a day there then. I know people do want us to carry on, but... Sorry, I'm really hungry. That's been two hours, and that's that's what we tend to do every week. We only did an hour and a half last week, so it was more than last week. Um, Ings doesn't respect Rowlandson and Bardell need to be hard on him. Yeah. Maybe. Good stuff as always. Thanks for doing them. Yeah, enjoyed it. Dan, did you have fun? Yeah, oh, I'm always enjoying it, brother. Always enjoying good. it. Good. A couple of wins as well. That's good. Um, so, everyone, thank you very much for tuning in. We do appreciate it. We'll be back on Saturday evening. I've got a couple of days off. Um, so, I'm back on Saturday. Back Happy at your work. birthday, is that? What are you doing? Uh, I don't know. I've got a surprise kind of. Oh, that could be something you planned. don't like. You're a bit fussy. That could be something you don't like. Yeah, potentially. <laughs> Fingers crossed. <laughs> I'll report back on that later. Um, yeah, but we'll be back Saturday night for the post Crystal Palace review. Uh, me and Matt Kendrick, I think, hopefully three points to Villa. Dan, thanks for your time as always. What are you frowning yeah, on? Don't, don't, don't watch that. Watch the Villa view. Uh, no one's ever heard of the Villa view. I'm, I'm going to the game, so I won't be able to do much draft. Ah, oh, it's more views for us. Uh, thank you very much for watching. <laughs> thanks for tuning in. And uh, we'll see you again on Saturday. Thank you for listening to Claret and Blue, an Aston Villa podcast. If you enjoyed today's episode, then please let us know. We love hearing your feedback. We'll be back.